Give me one sec. The music should be popping up now. We got that nice, sweet Pokemon music, and here come the captions. There they are. Captions, right? Y'all can see the captions? Lovely. Alright, everybody. Let me switch over to the source. Welcome to Pokemon Prism. Uh, where's that source? It's uh, the Game Boy Color source. That's it. All right, I think we're. I think we made pretty good progress in this game so far. I still love that that pseudo 3D crystal spinning in the background. I think that's dope as fuck. All right, let's see where we are in the game then. Oh, that's the B button. Yeah, so I think we're at six badges. I think we're at six badges. Yep, six badges right now. Excuse me. And we've got a lot more to get. <laughs> but hey, six badges is not bad. I will take that. Uh, what were we doing in this game? What were we do? Did we have to? Did we have to hop on uh, on some water and surf? Was that our problem? Hold on. Let me talk to our last quest NPC. Let me figure out what the last quest NPC said for us to do. That'll give me a bit of a hint as to where we need to go, I assume. Appreciate you taking your time to talk to an old man who has nothing but this... Okay, well, that was worthless. That taught me nothing. Okay. I think... I think we have to swim out to the east. I vaguely remember that being... Our, our form of progression here. could also swim back all of these ways. All of these ways, assumedly... Oh, you know what? No, 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 no. I remember. I think we had to go to Saxifrage. I think we needed to surf down this way. Hmm. If only I had watched that far in my own VOD. <laughs> How are we doing on health? Everybody's healed up. That's pretty good. Let's put, uh, let's put Shinigami out in front. Who has the EXP share? Who has the EXP share, guys? Buffalo Bill. Yeah, Buffalo Bill could use the EXP share. That's fair. Absolutely fair. All right. Let's try to run down here. We'll hop on, hop on the water. See if we can't get over to Saxy Fridge. Hey, yo, what's up, Vito? Welcome to the stream, dude. How's your day going? Okay, so, like, those rocks look pretty blocked off to me. What's up here? What are you doing? At this point, we can only hope that the Guardians don't harm anybody else. Yo, DMAC! Gotta leave older for now, but have some biddies for them titties. Haha, <laughs> biddies for them titties, yo, thank you. Thank you so much for the biddies, DMAC. Thank you so much for the lurk, dude. Good, I just hopped in before work. Oh, dude. Fuck work. Yo, dude. <laughs> Vito. What DMAC said? Vito, thank you so much for the 100 biddies, dude. <laughs> what DMAC said? You need a mining pick to mine. Why is there just like a huge rock in my way? I can't mine it. Thank you for the lurk. Thank you for coming in before uh, before work, dude. Ludacris. Yo, what's up, dude? Pee pee poo poo. Dude, you hyped for this fucking 24 hour stream? Okay, let me do my first plug of the day. Let me. Everybody's here. Let me do my first plug of the day. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. At 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Ludacris and I will be uh, starting. Uh, we will be. Kicking off our 24-hour charity stream. Yo, Dunyan Rings! Yo, no problem, dude. Welcome welcome to the community. I'm, uh, I'm glad you caught Ono's stream the other night. Or last night. I'm glad you had a fun time. Ono is uh, one, of our, one of our dope friends in this community. Um, he's super cool. Super, super cool. Uh, thank you for the follow as well, dude. I appreciate it. Um, but yeah, we're, we're doing a 24-hour charity stream. Starting at 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, tomorrow night. 
Ludacris and I will be on Discord playing uh, both co-op and like community games where like audience members can come play with us and stuff at some points uh, for 24 hours. 24 hours we will be online streaming barring any technical problems and we will be running a charity link all donations that go through the oh man oh what a, what, what a heart sprite i'm just kidding um any donations to the charity link will be funneled directly towards the trevor project the link will be set up through Streamlabs. um they they make us like a little little campaign website and everything it's nice and easy we're gonna we're gonna be here for 24 hours we're gonna try to hit two hundred dollars in donations we're gonna try to hit two hundred dollars over 24 hours so uh, if you got some free time anywhere after 11 p.m. tomorrow or Saturday come by and chill for a bit toss some uh, toss some money oh, toss some money at the Trevor project they're uh, they're a good organization they do Oh, excuse me. Sorry, I just ate breakfast. <laughs> uh, 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 they do. Uh, um, uh, they do crisis intervention. Crisis intervention for LGBTQIA plus individuals. Um, is sound good against water or was sound bad against water? I'm so psyched. That sounds so cool. If you need a Minecraft realm to use, let me know. I have one not yet used. What we're probably going to do is we're probably going to go play on your boy Vendetta's realm because he was going to join us for a little bit there. We've been building up a lot of cool stuff over there. Uh, a little bit off stream. I did a little bit of a secret Minecraft stream. I forgot to read if that was like super effective or not very effective or like blah 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 blah, you know. Maybe I'll just use a spark. Nothing wrong with a good old spark. But yeah, there's my uh, there's my pl my first plug of the day for our 24-hour charity event tomorrow. It would uh, it would mean the world if uh, some people came and chilled. Not for the whole 24 hours. That's ridiculous. Nobody should come chill for the whole 24 hours. It should just be us for the whole 24 hours. But you know, if you got some free time, come swing by, spread some love for uh, for a good cause. This uh, this stream's been in the works for a while. We've been uh, we've been talking about doing this. I think pretty much since November or December. That was when we first uh, first thought about doing this. So I'm glad we're finally getting around to it. All right, have a good one. I will definitely jump in and support, bro, dude. I appreciate it. You have a good day at work, man. Thank you for coming by. Yo, holy shit, Metal Goose. Yo, yo. Yo, yo, Metal Goose, thank you so much for the raid, dude. Let me uh, let me drop your shout out real quick. Welcome to the stream, Raiders. Welcome on in. Playing a little bit of Pokemon today. Yo, Bad Taste Bear, thank you for the lurk, dude. I hope you're having a great, fantastic day. We're doing pretty good today. I had I've I got some tea here. I got energy. We're doing pretty good. Hope you're having a dope day, dude. Oh, what am I looking for? Super potions? Super? Nope, that's a repel. Tea! Tea! Tea indeed. Uh, oh shit, so we can kind of swim around those rocks. This is a hard wall. This is an invisible wall, but you can tell it's going to be a wall because the water goes in two different directions. Interesting. Interesting move. Oh, yeah, so for anyone who just came in with the raid, I literally just did this five seconds ago, but then y'all raided. Um, for anyone who just came in with the raid, tomorrow we're doing a 24-hour charity stream. Uh, all the all the proceeds, we'll have a, a donation link set up, and all the proceeds will be going straight to the Trevor Project, which is an organization which provides crisis support for LGBTQIP plus individuals. Um, it's going to be a dope time. We're going to be kicking it off at 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. It's going to be Ludacris and I playing a bunch of co-op games and uh, some community games that everyone else can get involved with over the course of the stream. Yo, Patches, what's up, dude? Welcome on in. How's your day going, man? 
I hope it's uh, hope it's fucking fantastic. We're uh, we're making some progress in Pokemon Prism today. Is this guy gonna catch me as I walk past him, even though he's on the dock? Oh, he sure does. Hey, you. This is my fishing spot. Get a new one. Fucking loser, sitting on like two inches of dock, casting off your rod. Get a fucking boat, loser. Get a fucking dory. It's going good, man. 100% CTR. Now I'm just chilling, bro. How are you? Yo! Yo! I still need to play Crash Team Racing so bad. It's one of those games I wanted to play for forever, and I just haven't gotten the chance yet. Congratulations on the 100%. That could not have been easy, dude. I'm doing pretty good. I got my tea today. I got energy. I don't want to learn Endure. Yeah, no, we got some energy today. It's not like the other day where I started streaming. I was like, uh, I gotta beat Celeste. <laughs> no, no, we're good today. So this 24-hour stream, what all is planned as far as events, and is there anything I can do to help other than the obvious things? So... Pretty much all we got planned is uh, just like a shitload of, uh, of co-op games that Ludacris and I are going to play together. Um, if you want to do anything to help, uh, you could just like share, share our, our stream links or share the charity link once it goes live. Anything like that would help. But um, And obviously feel free to like come play some of the community games with us. We're going to be playing... Um, Scribble.io, Scribble.io, however you pronounce it. We're also going to be playing some Broken Picture Phone, which is um, which are great fun games to play with the community. Whalmer? No, I'm good. So yeah, just uh, just come chill. That's really all you gotta do. Come chill if you want to support. Um, hang out, have a fun time. It's pretty easy to help out with the 24-hour stuff. It's mostly Ludacris and I who get to do all the uh, all the streaming. We we've got to do the streaming, and you've all got to do the the loving, and that's that's pretty simple. About 18 hours and all. Nice, nice. I um I want to play that. I want to play Diddy Kong Racing. I think those two kart racers are games I would really enjoy. I just have not had the chance to play either of them, really, unfortunately. There's also like a Banjo Kazooie racing game on the GBA or something. That looks pretty neat. I kind of want to try that. Ever played Muppet Race Mania? I feel like I feel like my life is Muppet Race Mania. I have not. I think I might have heard of it though, but I have not personally played Muppet Race Mania. I feel like a Muppet racing manic. Some of my friends and I used to call each other Muppets. As both of a term of endearment and a term of God, you're a fucking idiot. <laughs> you fucking Muppet. It's just so fucking funny to call someone a fucking Muppet. <laughs> you know? There's something just raw and funny about it. Oh, good, you do the same. Same hat, dude, same hat. Same Muppet. What's this dude doing? Oh no, I don't want to surf. I want to talk to this dude. Caught these Pokemon with a pretty good rod. Nice. Well, I've, I've got a pretty good rod if I do say so myself. Fisher Denzel. Uh, excuse me. We're just shredding through all these water types with Shinigami. Do have a free day tomorrow, so I'll probably be there for most of the stream. Dope. Yeah, again, we're starting at uh, 11 p.m. EST. I, I'm saying tomorrow technically, because 11 p.m. EST is technically tomorrow, but it's uh, it's only one hour away from two days from now. But it does technically start tomorrow. Time isn't real anyways. I, uh, I totally appreciate you coming by and chilling with us for the, the 24 hour, though, dude. Appreciate it huge. I don't learn swagger. I don't. I don't need swagger. I don't need swagger because I have swag. 
Remember when everyone used to say swag? Oh, you know, I got a real throwback. Remember when everyone used to say beast mode? Beast mode evolved into swag. Both Pokemon will faint in three turns. You fucking cunt. <laughs> you fucking asshole. Where's that gonna get you? That just makes me rush to kill you. You're just gonna die faster so that I don't die. You fucking clown. You fucking muppet. Ah, uh, how's everybody's day going? How we all doing today? Oh, you know what? I forgot to grab the gold jacket. Lewisite? Is he using fucking banned chemical weapons against me again? Definitely using fucking banned chemical weapons against me in Pokemon. Hell yeah, I'm glad to hear you're doing good, Metal Goose. What were you, uh, what were you streaming today before you raided over, dude? And thank you again for the raid. Appreciate it huge, man. All right, I see that item over there. I want that item. Let's get that item. I need that item. Dragon scale. Neat. Neat. Do I have another super potion, please? There we go. We got seven more after I use this one. FF15, Clone Hero, and a few other games. Yo, I wanted to get Clone Hero working um, on my computer, but I only have a Bluetooth Rock Band controller. I don't have one of those wired ones. And um, you really you really should have a wired one, I guess. I was having a really hard time getting the latency and stuff set up through the Bluetooth one. It was a shame. I just want some, some classic Guitar Hero action, man. I miss it. I'm all pumped up! Hoo <laughs> ha! Ha ha! Pumped up! This dude looks the opposite of pumped up. This dude looks like I could break his limbs like little fucking tiny twigs, like little matches. He's little, <laughs> little skinny boy. Ha ha! Ha ha! Tentacruel. Give him a spark. Is not wrong. Is not wrong. Right. COVID nine. Oh, I've got a text about COVID nineteen. Isn't that just lovely? COVID nineteen capacity limits are extended. Well, that sucks. Can use keyboard and it's not bad, but definitely yeah. I um I used to play uh what was it Rhythm Hero Rhythm not Rhythm Heaven Rhythm Zone there was a Steam game that was kind of like a Guitar Hero Rock Band ripoff where you could put your own songs in it and you'd use the keyboard to play it and I played that a bit in middle school but it's I wanted the guitar I wanted to hold the guitar like when I used to play Rock Band on my Nintendo Wii. I don't want to change Pokemon. Why would I want to change po Oh, you know what? I could actually get a lot more XP if I was changing Pokemon. Right. Right, then. Maybe I'll uh, change Pokemon. I'm pretty sure I still have a Rock Band. Yeah, I got a Rock Band guitar controller sitting in the, uh, the back corner of my room. Maybe I should do guitar improvs on that. <laughs> you reckon people would uh, would have liked that? Yeah, switch out, dude. Let some other people get some XP. Let everybody get some XP from this Whalmer. Whalmer. More like f uh, Failmer. <laughs> oh shit, we got a little bit of a sandstorm going on now. Uh, yeah, just throw everybody in. Throw everybody in who's not level 45. Button ASMR, I'd be okay with that. How's that button ASMR? 
Maybe I should do like a, a little channel points redemption for play a fucking uh, guitar improv on the uh, on the rock band controller. Yo, Lamps, how are you doing today? Welcome to the stream, buddy. ASMR Pog. Oh yeah, what's the Pog face for today? Anyone know what the Pog face for today is? <laughs> Lovely, that's a pog face, all right. How's your day going, Lamps? Take us through a day in the life of Lamps. Specifically, this current day that we're living through right now. Throw eggnog out there, and then I'll switch back to the electric type. You don't want to know how much tea I just accidentally, like, dripped down my leg and onto my chair. I'm using a, a USB USB Xbox 360 controller that I've had for very many years. A long, a very, very long time. I'm good, we got a cat and it's comfortable enough for us to pet her now? Yo, that's awesome. I love it when you get a new cat and um, over time the cat gets so much more comfortable with you and stuff. I, I think cats are, cats are just epic, man. Uh, one of my moderators has a cat who uh, forgets me for like a little while when I first come over, like any time, any time I visit my friend. But then within about five to eight hours, he'll start coming around, hanging out, asking for pets. It's like meeting a new cat over and over and over, except it's not a new cat. He's just a cool guy. New cat, now that's Pog. <laughs> Damn right, Metal Goose. That, but you're darn tootin'. You're darn tootin'. Look at all that EXP everybody's getting. I am, I do feel blessed every time. It's like a new blessed experience. Hear me out. If the cat just always remembered me, then I wouldn't, I wouldn't go through the experience of earning the cat's trust over and over and over again. I wouldn't get that blessed feeling of the cat being like, I'm yet again choosing to ask you for attention that's what i really need i need the cat to come to me every single time and ask me for attention <laughs> excuse me <laughs> and then i burp and i scare the cat away how are we doing on the map are we getting close to the sacks of fragiles <laughs> not even close not even close Oh, we came from this way. I... I fucking came from this way. We're gonna run out of spark, PP. <laughs> PP. <laughs> PP. <laughs> PP. <laughs> Hold on, I'm just, uh... Setting up my, my phone. I got too much, too much shit on my desk. Too much garbage. <clears throat> I, I write down like a million fucking post-it notes. Actually, that reminds me. One of these post-it notes has names that we're supposed to name the Pokemon we catch in this game. Yo, expand, expand, expand dong. Shall we, <laughs> shall we read through some of the names? That chat has requested I, uh, I name Pokemon. Let's read through some of these names. Uh, Sugma. Sugma is the top one. I think I'm going to save that for if we catch Slugma. I'll name it Sugma. Another one is Anita Sug. Anita Sug. Could also use that for Slugma. Someone recommended we name Pokemon Toes. Four letters. Toes. Toes. They're on your feet. <laughs> I, I think I think Woof GG recommended this one. Babe on DVD. Babe on DVD. That'll be a fun Pokemon name. Hold on, I've got to decrease the quality of my stream preview because it's eating up my bandwidth. There we go. That'll be better. Um, Vaginosaur. Uh, I want to say Dmac probably suggested vaginosaur 
And someone came in during a Minecraft stream and suggested we name a Pokemon Aorn. Um, A-A-O-R-N. Aorn. So, we're gonna do that. Those are all the names we've got, uh, queued up for Pokemon that we catch. Yo, Jen! Jen, thank you so much for the, uh, the sub. Two months, wow. Time... Time just flies when you're having fun. Welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for the lurk. I hope you're having a great day. Hope you're getting plenty of rest. Hope you're feeling great. We're doing some, uh, some Pokemon. Hold on, let me, uh, let me drop you a, a shout-out real quick while I got a moment. Everybody go check out Qui-Gon Jinn. One of the, uh, one of the cool, one of our cool streamer pals. One of the coolest people I've had the great pleasure of meeting on Twitch. Now we'll surf again, and maybe we'll make some progress in the wrong direction. Is there nothing over here? There's gonna be no- Oh, there's an item over here. Ho ho! We got thunder? Imagine putting the thunder TM right in the middle of the god dang ocean. Shinigami, what are you doing? Hit him with a hit him with a thunder fang. We're getting low on spark PP. Oh, it's uh 3:28. It's probably about time I took my allergy medicine. No, I could wait a little longer. I think I got to take it around five today. Getting a phone call. I'd rather not pick that up right now. Rather not pick that up. Wild Tentacle appeared! Alright. That ought to take care of him then. It always throws me off seeing the, the tentacles come out of the bottom in the old sprites and they're blue instead of like greenish brown. I'm so used to the newer sprites where those are uh, a slightly different color. Definitely not blue. Where are we going? Oh shit, I found a dude. <laughs> I found a Pokemon before I found the dude. How many tentacles and tentacruels are you gonna throw at me? I do not want a tentacool or a tentacruel. I'm not interested. I already have a water type. I would like to get to my destination, my friend. I'm gonna need to use an ether. Fight this dude. My 100th lap for the day. If anyone plays Brawlhalla, I'd be down for an open invitational through Discord or something. You should totally uh, set that up. I don't play Brawlhalla, but uh, if you find, um, if you hop in one of the community Discords and you ping some games chats, I'm sure you'll find some people who'd be willing to uh, do a bit of an open invitational with you. I'm sure of it. Don't screech. That's an annoying fucking sound. You just made everyone in stream hear that sound. Why would you do that? I'm the only one who's allowed to scream on my stream. Oh, Shinigami is going to get so fucking OP. Hold on, let me switch out so some other people can catch up. Screech! Worry! Carl. Put in Carl. Look at that. <laughs> UWU for me, Daddy UWU Pengus. Yo, thank you for the, the, the biddies, DMAC. Would you like would you like an uwu? Would you like an uwu? Uh, uwu! 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 Scream Screams in black metal! Whoa! <laughs> yeah, I'm not supposed to be doing that, actually. Love me some black metal. I love it when they go... <laughs> nice screamo. Thanks, dude. Don't fucking bubble beam me, you fucking cheeky Muppet. Muppet is the insult of the day today. 
I have decided. I have decided. Uh, excuse me. Can we put Funk in? Get Funk some XP. Well, we're 30 minutes into stream. I got a burp. Now that we're 30 minutes into stream, today, uh, this might be another good time to plug our stream tomorrow. In case you haven't heard, we're doing a charity stream tomorrow. Uh, Ludacris and I, and at some points, ya boy Vendetta 7 we will be playing a bunch of, uh, co-op games and a couple community games where everyone in chat can come play with us. We're gonna be playing a couple, uh, a couple different games over 24 hours. And we're going to have a charity link set up. All donations are going to be funneled through that charity link into the Trevor Project, which is an organization which provides crisis support for LGBTQIAP plus individuals, which is a super cool organization. They do a good job. Um, we're going to be starting the stream at 11 p.m. tomorrow, Eastern Standard Time. 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, tomorrow. We will be going for 24 hours straight, barring any technical difficulties. Yo, Aeon, finishing up work stuff. We'll be in chat in a bit. Until then, Lurk. Yo, I appreciate the Lurk, Sono. Good luck with your work stuff. Good to see you. I hope you're having a wonderful day today, Sono. Well, back to swimming. Do I need to heal? I feel like I need to heal some folks up. Oh, I hate that the super repels come before the super potions. Funk. Bring in the noise, bring in the funk, but we forgot the noise. Is there anyone up here for me to fight? Well, I had to walk about a mile under medium heavy rain, but I took a nice shower since then, so now I'm good. Oh, damn. I, uh, I don't mind running through the rain, but if you're not in the mood for it, it kind of sucks. Change butt spots word. Uwu, daddy, uwu. Have you, you D Mac? I think you've been spending too much time with Ludacris. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. Uwu, daddy, uwu. You got it, D Mac. Speaking of long streams, I did. Yeah, you mentioned your 68 hour a little while back. We were all very, uh, very impressed. One more hour and you could have hit the 69, but 68 is pretty impressive regardless. Pretty fucking impressive. Pretty fucking impressive. I don't think I would do a 68. I think that would be a bit too much for me. I think 24 hours is probably going to be, like, a lot. 24 hours is going to take it out of me. Whether I do my Sunday variety stream the day after we finish that 24-hour stream, whether I do that stream is up in the air. It really depends on how my recovery is coming. It's not like we're <laughs> it's not like we're on a Discord voice call or anything. Are you guys fucking a sex role playing over the Discord call again? No, I'm just kidding. Y'all <laughs> as far as I know, y'all haven't done that a first time. That must be what the NSFW voice call is for in Ludacris's Discord, huh? Well, my tea is officially cold, guys. My tea is officially iced tea. I'm gonna use my last spark, PP. Guess it's time to switch over to the water, huh? <sighs> I thought the tea was supposed to be hot. It was. And then I spent too long trying to drink it. Well, I did another, and I hit the 69 mark. Oh, nice. So you did a 69-hour stream. Look at that. Dude, good job. That's fucking crazy. Uh, fucking huge props on the, the crazy long stream, dude. <laughs> this is a prison escapee. This doesn't look like a prison escapee. Although, I, I, I guess I shouldn't really categorize based on appearance, but it did say swimmer, as opposed to prison escapee. Oh, 
Hold on, while, while I've got uh, while I've got a second here, I'd like to store up some uh, some shoutouts for for DMAC and for Vito because I don't think I got them when they came in when they dropped their bitties. Oh shit, that last shoutout didn't work. Everybody, if you haven't checked out these uh, these two dope individuals, they're some of my good Twitch friends. They're very nice, very cool people. They do some very good stream content. And you know, they're just great people. So you should, uh, you should check them out if you haven't already. There were two downsides of doing that stream, and that's fatigue and loneliness. Yeah? Yep, that'll get you. That'll get you. I am, uh, I'm personally afraid of the, uh, the fatigue mostly getting me during my 24 hour. Which is why I will have plenty of caffeine on hand, ready to go. But, uh, the fatigue, I'm not so worried about the loneliness, because I know, uh, Ludacris will be right on call with me, so even if we have no one in chat, even, even in the rare circumstance that we have nobody in chat, no need for shower today, I'm already clean, hell yeah, Ivinto, welcome to the stream. Congratulations on being a clean fella today. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm not so worried about the loneliness during my 24 hour, but the, the, the fatigue? Fatigue could catch me. You never know. Ivinto, how is your day going today, man? How you doing? We are playing some- wow, we're taking a lot of, a lot of damage here just by switching out, getting greedy with XP. We are playing some Pokemon Prism again, as I'm sure you can tell from the stream title. Just kind of going through, making some progress, gonna see what we can get done today. If we could get a 7th gym badge today, maybe even an 8th gym badge today, that would be so fucking lovely. So fucking wonderful. <laughs> oh, you got seven Thunder Fangs left to use in this area. Pretty good. Installed an app to make moving wallpapers with some music behind it. It's pretty cool. How about you? Is that the um the wallpaper engine thing on, on Steam? I see some people using that. Or desktop engine or something like that. I've never used it. I, um... I haven't even changed my desktop from when I updated my OS recently. I just have a standard Windows desktop right now. I gotta get on that shit. Oh, uh, I'm doing pretty good. I'm having a pretty good day. We had some tea, so I have energy today. Um, I'm excited to be back with Pokemon Prison. It's kind of one of my favorite games I play on stream. It's a shame I rotate through so fucking much all the time that I don't get to play it except for like once a week. But it is one of my favorite games to play on stream, so I'm super excited to be back to it. And uh, I'm having a great time chilling with everybody in chat, so we're doing pretty good today. Funk can't learn more than four moves. Mustard gas. Should we let Funk use illegal weapons? I illegal chemical weaponry? I don't know, he's already got laughing gas. He's already got laughing gas. Wahoo! Uh, I should probably look up the, the stats. Hold on. Let me let me look up the stats for both of these moves. Pokemon Prism Laughing Gas. Laughing Gas has a power of 50 and 100% accuracy. And what was it? Mustard Gas, <laughs> the band banned by the Geneva Convention. <laughs> Mustard Gas, base power of 90 and 100% accuracy. Sometimes burns the target. Well, that's lovely. Yeah, let's use banned chemical weaponry. Well, the fatigue didn't really bother me. It was the loneliness because I didn't have anyone to talk to. So I was sitting there wondering why I was even doing the stream in the first place. You know, sometimes I found... This wasn't the way it was for me. Um, <clears throat> wasn't the way it was for me, but for some people. Uh, when they were first grinding out affiliate, they had to do a bunch of like one-hour streams. Because what they were doing is they were doing these super long streams, and they were streaming to a wall of nobody, um, and those were pulling down their average, those super long streams. So what they had to do was 
do a bunch of really really quick brief like one hour streams where they got at least three people in each one to to boost their their average up to affiliate and that's how they were finally able to get it and once those old streamers dropped off they were gucci it's my first time watching you in pc and i can finally see the cosplay goal we already reached it yes we reached the cosplay goal uh hopefully next week i want to do the the cosplay solar play dark souls 3 the ps4 is set up below me right now it should be ready to go Oh no! What's up? Welcome to the chat, bud. How you doing today? Oh no, I, uh, I had a question for you. Do you and Qui-Gon Jen want to be moderators on this channel? I've been, I've been meaning to ask for a while, and I just keep forgetting. I can go mod you guys right now. I think y'all are pretty, pretty dope people. Pretty good, pretty good heads on your shoulders. And I, I trust y'all with uh, moderation abilities, if that's something y'all want to do. But I also don't want to like force the <laughs> force the moderation position on you, if you don't want it. Do we have the strength, HM? Did we come all this way just to get stopped by a strength, HM? Did we seriously do this? Oh my god. Oh, I came all this way for nothing. <laughs> I would be down whenever I'm here. I'm always cool keeping an eye on the bad eggs. We don't get a lot of bad eggs, but hold on. Let me uh, let me mod you guys. Let me let me just mod you guys real quick. Uh, where's my where's my oh right? It's not under moderation. It's under fucking community for some reason. Community roles manager. Let me um. Hold on, give me a second. Hold on, your VIP badge might disappear for a second while I pop up the moderator badge. Let me throw moderator on you guys. There we go. All right, you guys should be uh should be moderators now. At her grandma's with the kids, but I'm sure she's cool. <laughs> sword power! <laughs> you upgraded from gem to sword. Welcome to the welcome to the party. Sword. Wait. Sword. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Did we we seriously came all this way? <laughs> we can't even go in here. We can't even. I'm all the way up here. What do you mean I'm all the way up here? I thought I'd be down here by now. What is going on? What? What is going on, eh? Is it possible I'm in the wrong area? I can't go any further down. The current is too fast to surf on. Yo, no problem, dude. No problemo. Y'all are y'all are here a lot. Y'all uh Y'all got a good sense of uh what's what's Gucci and what's not cool in chat. Yeah, I actually I've been meaning to do that since Cubone uh moderated both of us, like made us both mods, and I was like, oh shit, I gotta do that. And then I keep forgetting every time you guys fucking come in. I meant to ask for so long. It's literally been like weeks. I'd be off stream and I'm like, fuck, I forgot to do that again. Yo, Hardcore Turtle, welcome to the stream, dude. Pokemon Prism is a ROM hack. It is a, uh, a ROM hack. Oh my god, a Whalmer? I want to catch a Whalmer. It's a ROM hack for Pokemon Crystal, which adds so much fucking content. So much fucking content. Oh no, oh no has all the power <laughs> everywhere. That's what you get for being a, a dope person. Um, Pokemon Prism. Sorry, I gotta get my Pokemon Prism spiel. Pokemon Prism is a ROM hack that, um, adds two new regions. It adds the Naljo region and the Rijon region, which is kind of a ridiculous name for a region, I understand. Nice, we caught that Wilmer. Alright, guys, we're about to consult the list of on names um okay so looking at this list of names i think i want to use either toes or babe on dvd for wilmer do you guys have any any preference on whether we use the name toes or the name babe on dvd as suggested by chat 
Anyway, so they added two new regions in this game. Babe on DVD, hell yeah. They um, they added two new regions. They added the generations three and four Pokemon. Yo, thank you so much for the host, Hardcore Turtle. Hold on, let me uh, let me drop you a, a shout out real quick. Everybody, Hardcore Turtle is shooting for affiliate right now. If you could drop him a follow, if you could drop him a lurk sometime, that'd be dope. He's uh, playing through Final Fantasy IX on stream. He's doing all the 3D Final Fantasies, as far as I know. Babe on DVD. Um, what else did they add to this game? They added music from the later generations. There are 20... Re read the captions and read my lips. There are 20 gym badges. There are... Hold on, I'll prove it. I'll prove it. There are 20 gym badges. We have six of them. Playing through every Final Fantasy game, 7 to 15, except the MMOs. And I'll cover the MMOs. <laughs> well, not 11. I won't be playing 11. I just play 14. We need some health, don't we? What was I doing here? Oh yeah, not only did they add all of these badges, but you'll see we have mining, jeweling, smelting, and crafting stats. You can mine in this game, you can craft in this game. It's basically Minecraft. No, I'm just kidding. It's much more Pokemon than Minecraft, but it does have some some really neat elements. I think we're stuck. I don't think we can go down this way. I think we fucked up. I think we fucked up. Can I could I go this way? Could I like come through Facilia Town and come down here? This looks like a cool ROM hack. I played Crystal Clear, which is a hack that makes the game open world. That is actually one of the ROM hacks I was also looking into. Because I think that's pretty cool. You can, I think if I remember correctly, you could do the gyms in any order you wanted, and you could refight them. And it seemed like a really cool concept to me. It's a game I want to check out at some point. Uh, this game was recommended to me. This specific ROM hack was recommended by, um, Ya Boy Vendetta 7, as well as Bio Patches. They were playing through it on stream, and I was like, this looks fun as shit. I gotta get on this grind. <laughs> And so I got on this grind. Yeah, the gyms scale. Yeah, that's what I've heard. They scale depending on how many badges you've got. And they, uh, some of the some of the gym leaders have some really cool uh, Pokemon. And like, it's really cool to be able to see gym leaders so much stronger than they are in the uh, the original game. You know, I think that's awesome. The only Pokemon ROM hack I've ever played was Storm Silver, and that one was pretty sick as well. So I've I've dabbled with a couple ROM hacks. Over, over my great many years on the planet, I've dabbled with a couple ROM hacks. I've even, I've even played around with making a couple ROM hacks. Uh, but I never actually, uh, never actually finished any. I never spent, like, a lot of time on one. This one, however, I've been playing for 25 hours. That's more than I've spent in any other Pokemon ROM hack. This one has got my attention. I played through so many Pokemon ROM hacks, from needing something to do on the bus rides to school. Oh yeah, that would do it. There should be a way to go south out of this town through one of these caves. I think this might be it, yeah? Yeah, this looks like it. If you don't have a way to get across the water, your only option is to go back to the quarry. Well, guess what? I do have a way to get across water. By the way, Aeon, remember when I said that Bowers, Bowser's Fury was horrible? Well, I changed my mind. It's actually pretty good. I'm glad to hear that. That's exciting. Uh, what, what made you change your mind? Oh, shit. We got Dig. Dig is a good move. What? <laughs> Babes on DVD. Babes on DVD. Babes on DVD. The butt spot is fucking messing with my message that was setting the word. <laughs> Yo, Seth, what's up? It's open world too, so I thought it was cool. The, um... Are we talking about Bowser's Fury or are we talking about Crystal? Uh, Crystal Clear. How's it going, Seth? Welcome to the chat, bud. How are you doing today? Nintendo uploaded a video explaining the features it had, and it looked cool. Oh, nice, nice. Okay, cool, cool. Dope and awesome. Bowser's Fury. 
I'm just excited to play 3D World Online. That's going to be pretty dope. That's going to be pretty fun. The hair cracks me up every time I see it. Oh, you mean the, the character's hair? <laughs> Ginger Vegeta! <laughs> Doing well. Any deaths yet? I, my soul has died. I mean in the game, of course. Um, we've lost, we, we've, some Pokemon have died. Yeah. Um, but we're not doing a Nuzlocke, so we don't, like, actually lose them. This is actually a pretty tough, um, tough little ROM hack. Enter me. Yo, Cubone, welcome to the stream. I <laughs> look Ginger Vegeta. You're absolutely right. You're absolutely right. The hair looks like Ginger Vegeta. Oh no, you're 100% correct. We got a couple more people in chat, so this is probably a, a good time for me to uh, plug yet again. Tomorrow, we're doing a charity stream. Tomorrow, at 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Ludacris and I will be kicking off a 24-hour charity stream. We will have a link set up that will route donations directly to the Trevor Project, which is an organization which provides crisis intervention for LGBTQIA+ individuals. And during the stream, we're going to be playing a bunch of... Uh, a bunch of co-op games with each other. We're going to be opening up a couple of the community games to uh, people in chat, and we're all going to play together. Should be a fun time. So if you got some time, obviously don't stay for the entire 24-hour stream. That would be ridiculous. But if you got some time, come by and hang out, show some love, play some games with us. It should be a fun time tomorrow. Ya boy, Cumgus. Uh huh. Set word, ya boy, Cumgus. I wish I could donate, yo. I understand not everyone can donate. There's never any, never any shame. Nobody is required to participate in the the donating. Um, you know, whatever you whatever you can do. If you can't do stuff, that's fine. You know, everybody's got their own uh, their own economic situation. I understand that because I'm not fucking. I don't have a lot of money. I've got very very little money. Uh, so, dude, no shame at all. No worries, man. Hell yeah, I'll stop by. Yo, I appreciate it, Cubone. Shout out the stream in my Discord. Dude, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Whose channel will it be streamed on, or are you both going to be streaming separately? We are both going to be streaming to our individual channels. I'm going to be streaming on mine. Ludacris is going to be streaming over on uh, over on his. We will be on Discord together the whole time, and I'm what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to get one of those multi-stream links set up. So that uh, everyone can watch both of us if they so desire. But yeah, should be a good time. Yo, D Cannon, welcome to the stream, dude. How you doing, man? How uh, how are you enjoying Final Fantasy IX today? I caught a little bit of it. I caught you while you were in the uh, the bar, and then I was lurking a bit as I went to go check in on uh, Wee Scott's lad and hop around a little bit. How were you liking the game? We're all playing FF9. Dude, I'm glad you started. I'm glad you're enjoying it. How far did you get? I wasn't there for the end. I had to, I had to bounce out. But, uh, how far did you get? <laughs> yeah, everybody say hi to each other. Everybody, uh, everybody hang out. Say hi. Say hi to all your close friends. I know y'all know each other. I'm at the Snow Cavern now. Uh, true story... Like, five years ago, when I tried to play Final Fantasy IX, I got to the Snow Cavern, and then, for some reason, I just fucking, like, put the game down, and I stopped. I wasn't having a problem with it. I think I just got distracted. And so, for the longest time, the Snow Cavern was as far as I got in that game. And then I, uh... Then I played it again later. I played it again on stream. And then we're... <laughs> you want me to do an accent, DMAC? Uh, what what accent should I do? They're not going to stay the same the entire Scottish. Can I even do a Scottish accent? All right, laddie, we're gonna do a little bit of a Scottish accent. Is this Scottish? Is this Scottish? At all? Am I making a mockery? Am I making a mockery of y'all? You can tell me if I'm making a mockery of the Scots. It's okay. Aye, lad. <laughs> is is this a Scottish accent? Oi laddie! Oi laddie! I want you to remove the pickles from me trousers! <laughs> Scottish! <laughs> B 
Bloody Queef? Hold on, I, I missed Bloody Queef from Ludacris. What the fuck? Bloody Queef? B bloody fucking Queef! What the fuck are you on, Ludacris? What the fuck are you doing? Yeah, I was the same when I started it, but I'm gonna continue with it. Hey, fuck yeah, I love it. Fucking Bloody Queef. Just watch a Jack Septicai video and you'll learn how to do the accent, bro. Yeah, that's a great idea. That's a wonderful idea. Scottish cowboy scripture. D oh, Lamps got me with a cowboy scripture. Cubone. <laughs> read cowboy in Scottish. A -A read, read cowboy in Scottish. Where's the Agus, I? Thank you so much for the sub, Cubone. Hold on, let me let me shout you out real quick. I know everybody knows Cubone. But uh, everybody, please go check out Cubone and check out those those sweet fucking emotes. I wonder who made those fucking emotes for Cubone. I love those fuckers. Anyways, <laughs> shit, I didn't know it was gonna read the emotes. All right, so let's let's read a little bit of cowboy scripture, yeah. This one's got a picture of a uh, fucking hat and some gloves on it. Isn't that right? They're not an immediately obvious feature. The creases at the top of a cowboy hat are largely unique and are meant to represent personal style. Personal style. Let me read that one again. That was a short one. Let me read it again. Though not an immediately obvious feature, the creases at the top of a cowboy hat are largely unique and are meant to represent personal style. I feel like I'm doing a bit more of an Australian accent now. I feel like I've shifted from Scottish to uh, to Australian. I've been watching. T I've been hanging out with your boy Vendetta Seven too much. <laughs> I'm doing a bit of an Australian bit now. I feel like an absolute legend. You want to suss it out? I'm picking up on all the Australian lingo. <laughs> can we can we get some macas? <laughs> Let's suss it out. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for following Cubone Turtle. That's that's dope, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. What did I miss in chat? Where's it? Where's the haggis? <laughs> Scottish cowboy scripture. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. What if I just did a Shrek impression the entire time? You think cowboys are like, boy, howdy? That feller got some point creases on his hat. He's a sharp feller. I use my my cowboy hat to tell the other cowboys when I'm ready to fuck, when I'm rutting around like a bull, you know. Donkey! That'll do, Donkey! Princess Fiona. What are we even doing in this game? What the fuck am I trying to do? I've just been walking around trying to get this fucking accent down. Accents are not my fucking strong suit, gentlemen. Onions have layers. <laughs> get out of my swamp! I'm sorry, I'm yelling it. I'm yelling into the microphone. That can't be good for y'all. Turn down your volume. Just mute me. Mute- No, completely mute me. You shouldn't even have your volume up at all. You shouldn't be listening to me. It'll give you brain rot. I promise. I promise you'll get brain rot from it. Who needs the XP? Shinigami? No, not fucking Shinigami. Alright, let's fight this one. I'm dying. Lad, I'm dying right now. Lad, I'm absolutely fucking dying. I've got no idea what fucking accent I'm doing anymore. Alright, I'm gonna drop the accent. It's probably been like five minutes. I cannot, I cannot keep a consistent accent. It always changes over time. I'm glad y'all enjoy it, though. <laughs> let's, uh, let's switch around here. Let's switch around. The stream muted. Hat creased. Brain rotten. Cubone! <laughs> All I know how to do as Owen Wilson is wow. Wow. Do you want me to do you want me to say wow for five minutes? Sad Scottish sounds. How does Owen Wilson talk? Does it just does it just kinda like sound like wow? Well we're gonna we're gonna hit we're gonna we're gonna switch out our Pokemon. Wow. 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 Who was the first Pokemon in? Was it Carl? Wow. Wow. Hold on, I gotta make sure I'm doing the wow right. 
because I'm just kind of saying, wow. Let me get a, let me get a, a, a vocal clip off YouTube of Owen Wilson saying, wow. Okay, well, maybe instead of typing wow, I could type Owen Wilson, wow. Every Owen Wilson wow in chronological order, huh? This is a Kit Kat advertisement. This is a Domino's Pizza advertisement. Wow. This is a Domino's Pizza advertisement. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, wow. 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 Welcome to the shit stream where I say wow. Wow. World of Warcraft. Please stop. <laughs> Shit. Nah, dude, you're good. You're good. I got you. Wow. Wow, that was so menacing. Wow. All these wows make me need to blow my nose. Wow. 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 There goes my camera. <laughs> Wow! Wow! <laughs> wow! Okay, I'm having too much fun. I'm having too much fun. Monka S. <laughs> wow! Wow, S. Your boy Vendetta 7. Wow. Oh, hey, look at this legend right here. Your boy Vendetta 7 with the biddies. What, 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 a, what a fucking legend. Let's give a shout out to your boy Vendetta 7. Thanks for coming by. Thanks for coming by. Thanks for sussing out the channel. Do we know how to get strength yet? I I just got gated by strength. I just ran into a, a rock and I was like, fuck, I need strength to get through here. I'm trying to find strength myself, you boy Vendetta 7. That camera could be a good redemption actually. So the thing is, sometimes I just like, I pick up the ca hold on, it's, it's actually tangled and shit. Sometimes I just pick up the camera and I'm just like, hey, what's good? What's uh, what, what's good? I see you. Sometimes I just do that. Could be a good redemption. You're right. You're right. Wow. What are we making room for? Nature power? Nah. We don't need nature power. Menacing. Whoa. Yeah, Vendetta, I have no clue how to get strength yet. If I run into real trouble with it, I'll look it up, but uh, I want to explore a bit. There are certainly some directions I have not explored yet. I'm exploring in this direction right now, and there's still an, ent an entirely new uh, direction we've yet to explore. Wow. What's nature, what's nature ever done for us anyways? <laughs> we were just a band. It was just a band. It was just a band. Eggnog. Wow. Wow. Can I get a wow? Wow. Gonna go start my own st Oh shit, my chat just reset. Gonna go start my own stream soon. Talk to you guys later. Yo. Have a good stream, dude. Peace out. Thank you for coming by. Menacing. Yes, the, the JoJo menacing things. I got you, I got you. That's exactly what I thought when you said menacing, even before you put the, uh, <coughs> the what you call -ems. I'm gonna get back to work, be back soon. Yo, have a good have a good day at work. No problem for the shout-out, dude. Thank you for the biddies. Thank you for coming in. I hope you have a great day at work, man. Can't wait to, uh, maybe play some, uh, Minecraft or, uh, Grim Dawn or Hero Siege or whatever the fuck we play tonight, if we play anything. Peace out, dude. Thank you for coming by. Wabba. Excuse me. Wow. All right, let's finish off this tea that was hot but is now iced tea. What do you say? 
Yummy. Yummy, yummy. Is it dark out yet? When it's dark out, I'll get to open that door, because nobody's here. I eat at 6 p.m. I can chat uninterrupted now. Sono, you don't know how happy I am to hear that. I love chatting with you, man. You're so cool. Such a such a great dude to talk to on stream. Your stream, my stream, Ono's stream, whoever's stream. You're such a fun fella. We're doing pretty good. How are you doing? How was your day at work? Fuck, I still have to um I still have to look at your your short little VOD demonstrating the stream deck. I have to check out your VOD and I have to check out Holka's mental health stream VOD. I've got two VOD hold on, let me let me write that down. I've got two VODs I I'm meaning to check out. I've been like balls to the wall busy recently. So I've got a million things I've got to do. Let's see Sono's VOD and Holka's VOD. Check out both of those VODs. There we go. Can't can't forget to do it if it's written down. You know some other streamers do the pee break or they go drink something, but you blow your nose. I do the pee drink and the and the the. <laughs> I do the pee drink. I say no. I do the pee break and the and the and the drink break sometimes. I do not do the pee drink. I do not do. I chat chat chat. Chat, I do not, I do not do the pee drink. Put that camera back. But yeah, I do do the, the blow my nose breaks. Absolutely. I think I look ugly as a hell sitting here with a fucking tissue on my nose. Well, yesterday was my first day at this new job, and it was a company intro thing. Today was me setting up my workstation and all that, and getting uh, someone acquainted with the code base. Nice, nice. That's a pretty fucking epic. What are we doing here? I, I forget what we were doing in this game. Yo, cool boy, man, Adam. What's up? We're doing pretty good. We're just chilling, playing some Pokemon. Welcome to the stream, dude. Come on in. How's your day going? What's up with you? Eggnog? Yeah, throw an eggnog. I don't care. To be honest, who doesn't do the pee drink? <laughs> Chat's having a bit of a wild day. Doing okay? Happy to see someone playing my ROM hack. Dude, is this is this your ROM hack? Are you uh, are you part of the Rainbow Dev team? Or is this just like your favorite ROM hack? Oh shit, dude, you worked on this? Dude. Absolute Oh, oh, not not part of the team. Not Okay, I got you. I got you. I got you. Dude, this ROM hack's great. We've been having a, a great time playing through this. Uh, so I've been playing it. It was recommended to me by uh, my good friend who just popped into chat a little while ago. Your boy Vendetta7. He's been playing it. I was the guy who started it and dropped it after the, the cease and desist. Oh, fuck, dude. So you did work on it. Oh, my God, man. That's crazy. Right, Devin chat, guys. Devin chat. Dude, I, I, hope, uh, I hope my playthrough is doing, uh, doing justice to the game. Uh, fucking awesome idea, though. Huge, huge props to you, dude. I understand why you'd want to stop after the cease and desist. N Nintendo's kind of... Nintendo kind of likes to act, uh... Act like a pair of shoes sometimes. And they can get in the shoe box, <laughs> for all I fucking care. <laughs> well, props to you on, uh, on starting it. You, um... It only made the hack more popular. Yeah, it's like, they don't understand when they come down on stuff, when they rain down hard with cease and desist, it actually brings publicity to things that could use more publicity. Absolutely. I'm going to keep reminding you about the pee drink for a few streams. Oh, I'm sure you will. I won't be able to, <laughs> won't be able to live it down. The fucking pee drink. Yeah, I want to learn Dragon Pulse. Yo, I'm so glad you're enjoying Final Fantasy IX D Cannon. So many of us are playing through uh, Nine right now. It's a great game. What was I learning? Dragon Pulse? What do I want to get rid of for Dragon Pulse? Maybe Slash? Slash? Or maybe Bite. But I kind of want to replace Bite with Crunch at some point. Let's do Slash. Excuse me. 
Excuse me. Uh, yeah, cool boy. Uh, a lot of a lot of our pals in our little Twitch community have actually been playing through this specific ROM hack recently. Uh, your boy Vendetta Seven recommended it to me, as well as Bio Patches recommended it to me. They were both playing it on stream. Um, and Ludicrous, our friend Ludicrous underscore underscore, also started it on stream. Uh, he got stuck kind of early on, and I don't think he returned to it. He got distracted with some other games, but I'm sure he'll he'll go back to it at some point, probably. Um, he was... <laughs> I think he went the wrong way in one of the first towns. He was trying to get cut or something. I gotta sit down with him and tell him... <laughs> tell him he's gotta do some gyms or something. Um, but yeah, everyone's, everyone's been fucking enjoying the game a lot. We've been... Um, every time someone new comes in and asks, What the fuck is Pokemon Prism? I give them the whole spiel, I'm like, well, we got fucking 20 gym badges, we got new regions, we got music from the later gens, we got Pokemon from the later gens, mining, crafting, you got the whole deal in here. Um, I'm not sure who, who discovered it, but Biopatches told me that if you switch out your Pokemon during trainer fights, not wild fights, but trainer fights, they all get the, the max XP. So that's how we've been leveling a lot of our dudes. I can only imagine how fucky of a process hacking a ROM is. Mad respect. Yo, Pokemon ROMs? There are a lot of nice tools for hacking Pokemon ROMs. That's intentional, intentional because of the increased difficulty. I was always wondering if it was intentional or not. I felt like I was I was fucking with the game. Now now I'm perfectly justified in doing this. I have no qualms about switching everybody out anymore. Thank you for clarifying for me, dude. Appreciate it. <coughs> so no, there are a huge amount of tools designed specifically for hacking Pokemon games. Um it's definitely a huge effort. It's definitely like a lot of work, but there are there are a lot of great tools that make it just a little more accessible. Like I, I first discovered uh, Pokemon ROM hacking back in like sixth grade or seventh grade, and at that time, I had enough intelligence in, and I was stupid. I was I, like I didn't have enough intelligence. The tools were accessible enough that I was able to at least figure out like roughly how to use them in seventh grade. So Pokemon ROM hacking, a huge world, huge awesome cool world to get into where you can do lots of cool stuff and it it's definitely a lot of work, but it's definitely probably hopefully not as hard as you'd think. Yo, what up big boy? Yo, it's Trez. Yo, welcome to the stream, dude. Yo, you get them new PC parts in? Yeah? You get that new shit going? You got your stream up? Yeah, yeah? Have you been streaming, man? In early high school, I think. Yeah, I, I revisited Pokemon ROM hacking uh, multiple times throughout middle school and high school. I never made anything significant. Um, but, you know, I played around with it. I did a little bit of uh, scripting and hexadecimal. Streamed like seven hours last night. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, man. I didn't catch you last night. I'll have to catch you next time I see you on, dude. My bad. Yo, but I am absolutely glad you got your uh, your tech working again and you're on. That is great news, dude. I am fucking stoked for you, man. Hold on. Let me, um, let me give you a shout-out real quick. Everybody, it's Trevs has just returned to the, uh, the streaming scene. Got some new hardware. Doing some dope-ass streams. What have you, uh, what have you been, what have you been streaming? If I remember correctly, you said you played, uh, was it Guild Wars 2? Was that what you were streaming? Just need a new CPU. Oh, yeah, you don't want to bottleneck your CPU. Your boy Vendetta did that. The learning curve isn't easy. Yeah, there is, like, there's a lot of stuff that definitely stopped me when I was doing it. Some stuff I was definitely able to overcome. But, like, the learning curve for design elements as well as, um actual practices in uh, compilation and building the game. There's definitely a curve there. Shit, I still have some homework left. Be right back. Yo, good luck with that homework, Ivinta. Good luck, man. 
After playing Guild Wars 2 for like two hours, then I hopped on COD with Blind Weed and Tainted. Oh, nice. The TTO fam. The TTO bros. Yeah, I don't play a lot of COD, but um, I actually don't play any COD. But um, now that now that Star Wars Battlefront 2 is free for today, I I think I think Puff actually mentioned it in the Discord. Like, yo, get Battlefront 2. We'll bring TTO over there. Now that that's free, and everyone in TTO maybe has Battlefront 2, might get into some of that. I used to play a lot of Battlefront 2. ROM hacking also helps start my software dev career. You learn so much. Yo. I I would say I, I agree. But it's it's a little different for me. Uh, because I'm not in a software dev career. I would say I totally agree that uh, Pokemon ROM hacking sparked my interest in programming. Uh, definitely taught me a lot, of the, a lot of the basics. And definitely forced me... Forced me to want to... Uh, I do more coding, take more coding classes. I actually ended up as more of an artistic game developer, but I am a game developer. I do program games, I do art for games. And I think Pokemon ROM hacking absolutely set me upon that path. And then we met hackers, fuck. What is it on? I think it's on Epic Game Store right now for free. I think it is on the Epic Game Store. Yo, a fellow dev, cheers to that. Yo, Sono. Sono was such a cool dev. He just made a stream deck. He programmed a stream deck that runs through a Raspberry Pi. You should check out his VOD. It's really cool. It's for if you don't want to spend like $160 on a stream deck, you can run Sono's personally crafted stream deck off a of Raspberry Pi. Sono's dope. Sono's cool as fuck. Oh, I already fought that guy? Okay. Got a couple caves to explore here. Might as well. I'm gonna drop a save right here. Yeah, I would have no idea how to do that either, dude. <laughs> I would have absolutely no idea. The Nalja Ruins. Turns out my Xbox has to update first so I can hang here a little bit longer. Yo. Appreciate you coming back to hang. I hope that Xbox updates fast so you can hop on stream, dude. Yep, there's a highlight, that's a short showcase, and all the code's open source, so if that interests you at all, feel free to take a look. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Let me, uh... You got any more of that sip sip? We got a little bit of tea here. You wanna... You want some, some ice cold tea? I've also got water, if that's more your speed. Here, take a little bit of a... Hold on, let me, let me take the cap off. How are you supposed to... Yo, shit. Cool boy, thank you so much for the follow. Uh, you know what we do here for new followers is we drop them, we drop them a little bit of a guitar improv. And so, if you don't mind, we're gonna welcome you to the welcome you to the party with a little bit of guitar. Thank you so much for the follow, my friend. Thank you so much. I was very thirsty. Yo, I've got to do an accent. All right, there's no promise that that accent is gonna stay the same the entire time, but I will absolutely do an accent for you, hardcore turtle. Google Translate. What the fuck kind of accent is a uh, Google Translate? What shall we play today, gamers? I want to play something new. And I hope you enjoyed. Talk like the Google robot. How does the Google robot... I, I just don't know what that sounds like. I just don't know. I just don't know what that sounds like. Yo, that has some serious uh, SOAD intro vibes too. Oh, 
System of a Down. I've listened to a little bit of System of a Down. They do like that that acoustic intro sometimes, don't they? They like their drop D. That was mostly drop D, what I just played. It's not an entirely drop D tuning, but that, that part that I was playing on is drop D. Let me turn back on the game music, both for myself and for you guys. Nice, dude. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed. Welcome to the, uh, welcome to the follower pack. Welcome to the stream. I hope you enjoy your stay here. What is in the Naljo ruins? Gonna head out to work. Hope everyone has a good day. Yo, Ludacris, thank you so much for coming by, man. Hope you have a good day at work. It was a great time to mention again. Uh, Lu is what, now that Ludacris is just... <laughs> okay, Lois, do a Peter Griffin impression. I don't do a really good Peter. But, um... My balls! The teenagers slapped my balls off, Lois! This is a great time to mention... That's, that's, see, that's not Peter Griffin. Now, this is a great time to mention that, uh... Tomorrow, we're gonna be doing a 24-hour charity stream, Lois. We're gonna be doing a 24-hour charity stream at 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Peter, Peter, why are you doing a charity stream? <laughs> yeah, well, Lois, we're gonna be doing a 24-hour charity stream for what am I fighting, Geo dude? For the Trevor Prize. <laughs> I can't fucking do this. Hey, Lois, what's that? Peter, I already told you. Peter, don't turn me into marketable plushies. Peter! Peter, I pooped my pants! <coughs> okay. Uh, I, I think, I think I'm good. I think I'm good on the accents. I think I'm good on the, the, the... <laughs> Shut up, Meg! Shut up, Meg! Yeah, shut up, Meg! Oh, I can do the guy in the... Oh, what's the guy in the wheelchair's name? He's got that Kronk voice. The poison. The poison for Cusco. Cusco's poison. Joe. Yeah, I could do... I can do Joe. I can do Joe in the wheelchair. We're doing a 24-hour charity stream tomorrow. Isn't that right, Peter? Peter? Cleveland. What, is, what does Cleveland sound like? I'm Cleveland Brown. I'm, I'm, Cl I don't watch a lot of Family Guy. I don't watch, like, any Family Guy anymore. It's been, like, a long time since I watched any, any Family Guy. Anyways. <laughs> anyways, let, let me, let me talk about the 24-hour charity stream. <coughs> We're doing a 24-hour charity stream tomorrow. Ludacris and I are saddling up at 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Saddling up like cowboys, you could say. Like cowboys. And we are going to be playing both community and co-op games, uh, some of which uh, people in the audience can get involved with. Saddle, oh, you're still here. I'm talking about I'm talking about a 24-hour stream. This is Ludacris. He's going to be playing uh, playing the games with us. Macaroni can't be recalled. Oh, Trap Inch has Sand Trap, doesn't he? Fucking bastard. Um, so we're going to be doing a 24-hour charity stream. We're going to have a donation link. We're both going to be streaming to our separate channels, but we're going to be on Discord together, playing a bunch of games for 24 hours. Barring any technical problems, all of the donations that go through the donation link that we will provide. Yeah, Battlefront 2 is huge, Trebs. It's fucking huge. It is why I keep uninstalling it from my computer, sadly. Several hidden pits inside the Nalja ruins. You can jump over pits to reach new areas. And you... Oh, excuse me. You can also jump over pits that haven't been uncovered. That's just in case you want to be careful. Okay. <laughs> trying to make room for it now. Yeah, I should make sure I got room for it. <laughs> I gotta reinstall it tonight for our stream. Um, let me finish my spiel about the 24-hour charity stream. All of the um, all of the donations that go through the uh, the donation link we provide will be routed directly to the Trevor Project through Streamlabs. The Trevor Project is an organization which provides crisis support for LGBTQIA+ individuals. They're a really cool organization. One of my friends on Twitch recently did another charity stream for them. 
Um, and I was like, hey, Ludacris and I have been wanting to do a, a charity stream for a while. Let's just do it for the Trevor Project. So we've got that all set up. Here, hold on. If I um, if I even switch sources right now, I can show you guys the uh, the tracker. If it pops up, see, we got a little tracker right at the top for Trevor Project charity stream donations, which is hooked up to our um, our Trevor Project donation page through Streamlabs. Streamlabs really expedites a lot of this whole process. It made it so easy to do. Um, but yeah, it should be nice and nice and easy for us. Really, the hard part is trying not to fall asleep. So if you need to borrow my Jackbot games like last time, let me know. <laughs> that could be pretty fun. That could be uh, that could be a good idea for the the community games. Yeah, Jackbox is fun, dude. We're gonna be playing some uh, Scriblios and stuff like that. Am I? I'm fighting a wild poke. Why am I switching everybody out? I thought I was fighting a trainer. Dumb, 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 stupid. Dumb, 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 stupid. I thought I was fighting a trainer. We play Jackbox at work every couple weeks. Yo, Jackbox is really fun. I really like the drawing ones. You get to draw some funny shit. I like drawing monkeys or like huge fucking cocks or like big poops. Everybody loves when you draw poops and stuff. If I didn't have this four terabyte hard drive, I would have no space. Yeehaw! Haven't tried that one. There's a couple where you can draw. I think TKO you can draw. TKO's great. It's the t-shirt one. Unfortunately, everything at the office has to be safe for work. Understandable. So no no poop drawing. Yeah, we, we have to keep it safe for work for stream as well. It's going to be a little less funny, but, you know, we'll keep it keep it on the level. Civic Doodle, that's another one. Civic Doodle's fun. I need to take this EXP share off of Buffalo Bill... And I need to give it to Macaroni. I really like the rapping game. I'm not sure if I've played the rapping one. I'm not sure if I've played the rapping one. Now switch that Razor Claw into Buffalo Bill. Yeah, that's what we're talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Get kind of low on super potions. Drop one in Funk real quick. That'll do for now. I hope I'm supposed to be in the Nalja Ruins. Probably good to explore anyways. Got an exit here. Cathrite Tunnel. Oh shit, look at how far we've gone. Now I'm out later, y'all. Yo, thank you for coming by, Ludacris. Thank you for coming by. Oh, wait, hold on. Before you hop out of here, let me... um. Let me drop you a shout out. Ludacris is the person that I'm going to be doing the 24 hour with. He's going to be streaming to his channel. I'm going to be streaming to mine. We're both going to be on Discord. We're working for the same charity. We're doing the same thing. So uh, make sure to check him out. If you're, if you're checking me out for the for the charity, make sure you check him out as well. It'd be very cool. Wow, it's way too cold in here. Unless I want to catch hypothermia, I'd better head back for now. Thank you for keeping me from going the wrong way, cool boy. <laughs> Thank you for telling me which is the correct way and the wrong way. Hello, hello, hello. I am a revered archaeologist. Catch hypothermia? Yeah, you gotta, like, catch it in your baseball mitt. Holy shit. Why is my... Hold on. I'm, I'm the wrong color on stream. I'm, like, I'm way too orange right now. Oh, that's because there's kind of, a, kind of an orange, yellowish, palish, brownish background in the game. I get it, I get it. We're good. A revered archaeologist. Naljo has such an alluring history. Yeah, so does my hole. Did you know? These ruins used to be a temple. There's like 10,000 dialogues. I screwed up quite a few. Yo, no worries, dude. No worries. Everyone in Naljo would come in here to worship the four guardians. But it's now in a state of decay because nobody is using it anymore. If you bring me something truly exciting from the inside, maybe I'll give you a reward. So he wants me to find something exciting from inside the ruins for a reward. Gotta go lurk mode now. Yo, thank you for the lurk, Hardcore Turtle. Appreciate it, dude. Ah, uh, yeah, them lurk emotes. Yeah, that's a lot of dialogue. You really can't hate. You really can't. Should I catch a Trap Inch? I love Trap Inch. I kind of want to catch one. Kind of want to catch one. Yo, cool boy. For the longest time, we thought there were only, like, two new types in this game. 
and then I looked it up one day, and I saw there were like fucking five new types. We thought it was just gas and sound at first. We hadn't looked anything up. Call it out if you think it's funny. Got you, man. Get the fucking trap inch. We're gonna get the fucking trap inch, and you know what we're gonna name it? Hold on, let me cross off Babe on DVD, because we, we already named one Babe on DVD. You know what we're gonna name this guy? Chat. Chat, I think we're gonna name this one Toes. We're gonna cross Toes off of our list. We've only got one, two, three, four more. Four more names we gotta name. There are only two new types. The one saying five types are wrong. There were five in beta, but I removed three of them before release. Okay, so there are two new types. Okay. So we were originally right. Okay, thank you for clearing that up. I was, I was really, really concerned because I had only seen the two new ones, and I was like, which Pokemon have these other three types? I haven't seen them. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much, dude. Oh, dude, our bitrate is sucking shit right now. What the fuck? Yeah, the other types weren't good. I, I don't remember what they all were. One of them was wood, I think, right? And I don't remember the other two. Yeah, I'm glad you guys went with two. Two is like a, a good good amount of types for me to uh, look at and say, yeah, I can learn two types. You know, I say I can learn two types, but I've, I still haven't even fucking learned fairy type from however many generations ago. <laughs> Yeah, wood doesn't work when we already have grass. That's almost word for word what we said on stream when we discovered that wood was a type. Or wood might have been a type. I guess it's not a type. We said, why is there a wood type? There's already a grass type. I'm glad you guys had the same thought. You had the, the same, same development process. Same hat, frankly. Big dick energy. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess I'll just use ghost moves against this dude. Made a lot of bad decisions that I later came back and changed. <laughs> I ain't got no type bad bitches is the only thing that I like. <laughs> Yo, Lance, thank you so much for the 69 bitties. Yeehaw! 69 bitties! That's called every development process. <laughs> Yeah, I, I would have to agree. I would have to agree. That happens to me a lot. I actually get I get stuck in these cycles of development where I, I overscope originally. How cacturn. Cockturn. As the cock turns. I make a lot of decisions early on or I like overscope or something and then like later on I'm like, what the fuck am I doing? Still probably better than Call of Duty development. Probably. I don't know anything about that, but I'm going to say probably. I'm going to say probably, yeah. Ooh, excuse me. Does reskin, <laughs> does reskin count as development? <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. Good one. I know someone who works on COD and he hates working. I could, oh my god, I could never work on COD year after year doing the exact same shit. Yo, I would be in the same boat. That would literally be terrible. Hates working on the same damn game over and over. I can't blame him. Can't blame him, dude. You think that's bad? Think about the fucking Blizzard developers who have been doing nothing but working on World of Warcraft for the last fucking 20 years. <clears throat> He's one of the graphics guys. Do they uh, do they mistreat their art department there? I, I tend to feel like artists get super mistreated. Oh, got ourselves a bit of a secret entrance. Imagine reliving your work every two years. There's still art alternating studios right now. Fuck Blizzard, yeah, it would be cool if they could do something interesting with their games. I guess, uh, I guess Heroes of the Storm was, um, was okay for a while, but it could have, it could have done a whole lot more. Um, I got tired of Overwatch. I think the only Blizzard game 
Yeah, Hots was okay. I think I think I would rather play Hots than like Dota. Or like I don't know. I don't mind Overwatch. I think Overwatch is pretty fun, but I definitely can't play it as much as I used to. World of Warcraft, I got kind of tired of. Diablo is something I haven't played a lot of time in. I would like to play some more Diablo, I think. StarCraft 1 was fun, but I don't like the multiplayer. I just, I like vibing in the campaign mode by myself. Comes out with a game every two or three years. Terrible, terrible. That must be a horrible experience. Bro, they won't even give my account back. I'm still in an... Yo, Blizzard's holding your account hostage? What the fuck happened? What the fuck happened to your main? That's, that's fucked. That's no no good. Oh, no. We fell, fell down another hole. Oh, we fell down another hole. We fell down another hole. <laughs> ho, ho. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Probably going to fall down a lot of holes here, but I'm okay with that. Because it will give us just a little bit more grinding time, which is something we kind of need. We could use a little bit of grinding, not gonna lie. My account got hacked and they won't even let me have it back even though I showed them a screenshot of my receipt to the account. What the fuck? That's fucked up, dude. It's no bueno. It's not very cool of them. How long ago did that happen? It's kind of weird to think about the fact that Blizzard, like, everybody knows Blizzard today for World of Warcraft, but, like, way back, they were making, oh, shit, there was a hole here the whole time, but way back, they were making a, a whole bunch of different games, you know? What do we got? Oh, this is a large place down here, isn't it? Got kind of a large area. Two weeks ago, I was level 469 on Call of Duty. Oh, fuck, and you lost that, man? Back to level 55. That sucks, dude. I don't know anything about the leveling in Call of Duty, but that sounds like a lot of fucking lost progress. I'm sorry. <coughs> how do I jump in this game again? How, how do I how do I jump in this game? Does it just kind of automatically do it? No. I forgot how to jump. Hey, cool boy. <laughs> it's been a while since I played this. It's been a week. How do you jump again? Which button is jump? Bro, I had Dark Ether, aka all the guns diamond. Oh shit, that sounds really impressive. Just face the hole and press A. Okay, I got you. I pressed B. I ran straight into the hole. Is is what my problem was. You know, sometimes you see a hole. Sometimes you see a hole and you've got to run straight into it. <laughs> that ever happened to you guys? Just, oh, blood butt spot. Just face the hole in bloody queef, A. Eh? Butt spot. That's fucking disgusting. Butt spot. Butt spot. Butt spot. Butt spot. What the fuck? Put that camera back there. Carl gained a boosted 1,171 XP points. D didn't he? Isn't that right? That's how STIs get spread. Don't need to learn Calm Mind. Good. Like, I actually can't wait for people to play Battlefront 2 because I'm down to try it with people. Dude, I used to play so much Battlefront 2. In college, I, w I would straight up have Battlefront 2 LAN parties. My, my friend would come over and sit in my kitchen, and I would sit in my room, and we'd yell back and forth. We'd get ridiculously drunk, and we'd yell back and forth while we were playing Battlefront 2. Honest to God, I was better at Battlefront 2 when I was drunk. I, I go back and I play it sober and I'm like, wow, I'm sucking shit at this. But when I was drunk, I was like, boom, headshot, boom, headshot, kill. I got the Jedi, I'm fucking shredding shit up. Don't know what, what that was about. All of these stairs lead to this. Interesting. Okay, we jumped over that. We're going to fall down a hole here. Kind of predicted that one would be there. Jump, jump. Oh, there's another hole here. Oh, no. Oh, no. There's another hole here. Of course there is. Of course there is. I should go on the one spot that I know is safe. Jump, jump. 
I can't jump here. All right. We got the yellow ranger up here. The area is supposed to just give a tutorial on how holes and jumping works. Gotcha, gotcha. Sounds like my boy Lively. He is okay at Call of Duty Sober, but when he touches the tequila, he is cracked. <laughs> nice, dude. Um, I don't know exactly what he's got, but he's yellow, so maybe maybe electric types. Probably Pokemon that are yellow, some of which may be electric types, from what I've seen from these guys. Oh shit, apparently the world record route for Dark Souls 1 remastered, any percent glitchless, is RNG free as far as required items. Nice! You should, uh, you should totally run that. You could probably put everyone in our community to shame by, uh, by fucking running Dark Souls 1. Showing everyone how impressive you are at it. I don't want to go to work. Dude, nobody wants to go to work. Fuck work, Trevs. What do you do for work, man? Uh, if you, if you feel like sharing, of course. We, uh, we respect privacy and identity in these parts. Electabuzz! We got macaroni. I've been working from home since the pandemic. I've not had a job since the pandemic. I'm dying. <laughs> All of my income is from art commissions and Twitch. <laughs> and that's not a lot of income. <laughs> that is like that's that's not a lot. Um I had a really promising job interview. Here's what went down. I had this super awesome promising job interview for a game development, game design position. And then this uh, fucking pandemic hit. And all of their job opportunities, including the one that I interviewed for, disappeared from their website. And ever since then, I haven't even been able to get like minimum wage shit. I've been applying at like dispensaries and shit around my town and... This is like, I guess I guess jobs just don't exist right now. <laughs> Sorry to hear that. A lot of people are dealing with the same problem. Yep, it's pretty horrible. Yeah, I know I'm not alone. Um, on some level, it's like it's 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 okay. It's like I hey, I'm not alone. You know, I'm not the only one dealing with this. But on the other hand, that almost just makes me more upset. That other people are also struggling in the same way. I would rather less people be struggling. You know? But, um, you know, you know, you know. What are you gonna do? What are you, what are you gonna do? I lost my old job because of the pandemic, but I found a new one. Yo, props to you on finding a new one. It's not hard. I mean, it's not easy. It's kind of hard. So congratulations, dude. I'm glad you were able to find some new work. That's fucking dope, man. I just hope it's safe stuff. A lot of my friends are in... Yeah, the, the friends who do have jobs, they're in unsafe environments. <laughs> you are stirring my an anti-capitalist insides, Aeon. Ho oh, I'm, ho I'm stirring your insides, am I? <laughs> what Pokemon was he sending out? Does anyone, does anyone fucking remember what Pokemon this dude was sending out? Typhlosion! Typhlosion, okay. <laughs> Fuck, I wish. Ah, uh, macaroni. I just like bounce between them all, get them some XP. I want to call off work. You know what? You're valid, man. You are valid there there were a couple oper there were a couple times uh, back years ago when I worked at a restaurant in my town when I was just fucking dead man I did not want to go into work and so I called them and I was like yo I'm I'm like halfway across the state and my car broke down and I, I would actually be halfway across the state because I didn't plan on working. I got in my car. I drove halfway across the state to, I don't know, like, hook up with someone or hang out with some people or some shit like that. And then I called them from their house and be like, yeah, my car broke down. I won't make it in. And then they'd have the, the fucking audacity to be like, oh, are you sure you can't make it in? I'm like, dude, I'm two hours away. And... 
my car is broken. I can't make it in. Honestly, I don't feel 100%. Yeah, tell him you got a fever, dude. Tell him you got a fever. Dust Devil? Dust Devil? I don't know the move, Dust Devil. Yo, if that's not going to give you any trouble later down the line, you do that. Yeah, I, I always support that. Hold on, I got to look up Dust Devil. Pokemon Prism Dust Devil. I don't know if this is like an actual... Rock type move has a base power of 80 and 100% accuracy. When used, it causes damage and can sometimes summon a sandstorm that lasts for five turns, damaging all combatants slightly every turn except for rock. Oh, that's nice. That's a good one. Dust Devil is a good move. I I didn't even know Dust Devil. It is 100% a rock move. That's good. I like me some 100% moves. Um, I might want to toss it in for ancient power yeah i think i want to toss it in for ancient power it's not going to give me any trouble because the store manager doesn't care if you go in or not just have to call before you work and say you can't make it or you don't feel good nice that's good some of my managers were real dicks i was dating someone one time who was like hey i i they called up their manager and they were like hey i literally can't make it into work today and their manager like gave them like a professional store uh, strike or something for not being at work. I was like, oh my god. Like, you literally can't make it to work and they're gonna fucking give you shit for it? Fucking cringe, dude. Fucking cringe. Yeah, no, some managers are shit. Absolute shit. Shit. Yo, cool boy. I gotta say, one of the one of my favorite additions to this game was the trade stone. Dude, the trade stone the trade stone came in clutch. Cause we we had Haunter and we wanted Gengar. We got that trade stone, we popped it on this dude. Now we got ourselves a little Gengar. Dealt with one or two of those in my life. Who hasn't? I use I've worked in a lot of restaurants. My least favorite thing. My favorite thing. The worst thing in the world is when you'd be sitting there in the in the kitchen. You have nothing to do. There's no food to run. There's nothing to do. And these the managers come in and be like, "Oh, you're not doing anything. You you could be cleaning." Like, dude, shut up. The kitchen is spotless. There's no food in the window. I'm taking a moment to lean over and yawn. Like I'm I'm literally like leaning on like this on the table. I yawn a bit because I didn't get a lot of sleep. And the manager walks in. He's like, "If you're le if you got, if you lean, you got time to clean." Shut the fuck up, Joe. I'll fucking kick your shriveled dick in so far. You fucking piece of cock. What an asshole. Yeah, fuck you, Joe. <laughs> I had to be at the doctor's for five hours this morning. What the fuck? I was there for six a.m. for an ultrasound because of my stomach issue. And I, oh, I've had stomach issues, dude. I've had a lot of GI pain. That shit's no fun. I had to get an ultrasound, and they didn't even fucking find anything. Most people don't trade with ROM hacks, so trade stone is necessary to complete the Pokedex. Yeah, I would have no idea if I could even trade using uh, the setup I'm using for this. That's plenty of reasons to call off. Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> I need to go for a general checkup. Just worried about the pandemic. So here, here's the rundown on doctors. They're pretty okay right now. Going to the doctors is relatively okay right now, because they only let, like, one or two people into the waiting room at a time. You wear a mask. They, they're they pretty safe. They're, I mean, they're frontline workers, so most of them, most of the doctors are probably, hopefully, vaccinated by now. Um, going to the doctors isn't the scariest place to go right now. You want to know my scariest place to go right now? I would say the fucking grocery store. The grocery store is fucking scary. I'm just gonna say, hey, the doctors called me and wanted to uh, wanted me to go and get checked. I can't make it. Ah, yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, tell them you got you got shit going on, man. You're valid. T take a break. It's a rough time in the world right now. Sometimes you need to take a break. <coughs> I just want to go to the gym again. The Pokemon gym. Gym was so careful, zero cases out of it. I would still be super, super sketched out if I was going to the gym. I gotta run back and hit the Pokemon Center. 
These these rangers always take it out of me. Do we have a, an escape rope? I would be super sketched out if I was going to the gym. I know, like, everyone wipes down the stuff, or everyone's supposed to wipe down the stuff. But honestly, this this isn't, I'm already a bit of a hypochondriac, and this whole thing has definitely made it worse on me. Um, you know? But luckily, I have I have some weights behind me. My friend just gave me a pull-up bar for Christmas. Um, I've got a I've got kind of like an exercise bike in my basement. Not like a bike, more like a stair thing I can use. So I'm not hurting for exercise. I can exercise whenever I need. I also need to call off tomorrow because I have a therapy session from five to six. Oh hell yeah, get a get a double day break. I understand if people feel that way, but I wish they kept them open so people could choose if they want to go or not. Yeah, so like I'm, I'm kind of torn on it. I mean, some people are definitely going to be careful, but you're always going to have those assholes who aren't careful enough, and they're going to ruin it for everybody. And that's that's the real problem, is somebody's going to ruin it for everybody, and then everybody's going to suffer for it. So nobody can have nice things, because God fucking damn it. God fucking damn it. DMAC hypes. DMAC hypes. I don't trust other people to do something that's going to affect others, not them. Fuck, I wouldn't trust me in that situation either. Yeah, so no, that's, that's pretty much how I feel. Oh, cool, I have one of those. Can I have that pull-up bar? <laughs> no, I need it. I need it. I need to get, to get ripped. I still have to build it, too. I still gotta build the fucker. It was open in October for a bit. I kept my mask on when lifting. Yeah, I, I think you, you, go with a, you go with your mask. You go, um... You wipe down the shit. You're doing a good job. But you also gotta remember, like, people... People who are willing to go out to the gym... Not necessarily everyone. Definitely not everyone, because clearly... You're safe, and you're willing to go, but a lot of people who would be willing to go out to the gym right now in this situation are probably people who would not be safe, deny the pandemic overall, think it's a sham, probably won't wipe down their equipment, probably might not have their mask up over their nose. You just gotta stay safe. Yeah, the one thing this has taught me, this pandemic has taught me, I mean, like, I knew this for a while, but this pandemic has really taught me that sometimes sometimes you really just can't trust people there are a lot of good people in the world see it's weird the pandemic taught me t the pandemic taught me that you can't really trust all people and there are a lot of shit people but recently twitch has taught me twitch has taught me that there are still a lot of good people in the world and it's just that all the good people are at home on twitch <laughs> no i'm just kidding i'm just kidding um yeah no i i'm in a i'm in a kind of a weird spot where there are a lot of garb. I know there are a lot of garbage people, but I'm also seeing a lot of wonderful people on Twitch, and it's reminding me, like, hey, there are actually some great people in the world. I feel like wearing your mask and working out would be hard to breathe. It is. I I try wearing it after I go for a run, and I'm like, damn, can't breathe. Those people are just selfish. Yeah, people in my apartment complex usually walk around without masks. It pisses me off. You're valid, man. You're valid. All right, I gotta go. I'll catch you later. Yo, Trevs, thank you for coming by. Good luck with uh, calling off work. Hope you have a good day, man. Thank you for hanging out with us for a bit. It's hard, but it's better than not working out. Yeah. Luckily, um, luckily I don't have to wear a mask where I work out within my own residence, so I don't really have to deal with that. Unless I'm like walking past someone else who uh, who lives with me, then I'll put on a mask. But uh, generally, when I'm working out, they're not in the area where I'm working out, so I, I get to breathe freely. See you later, Trevs. Sono, enjoy that coffee. Thank you for the lurk. Oh shit, we're almost at two hours. We're almost at two hours of stream today. How lovely. Probably a great time to uh, plug the 24-hour stream again tomorrow. If, so if, if you haven't heard me say it 20 times already... If you haven't heard me say it 50,000 fucking times already, tomorrow we're doing a bit of a charity stream. Starting at 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Ludacris and I will be doing a co-op stream. We'll both be streaming on our individual channels, but we'll be on Discord together playing co-op games. We're going to be doing 24 hours of streaming in order to collect funding for The Trevor Project. The Trevor Project is an organization which provides crisis support to LGBTQIA+ individuals. They do a lot of good work. One of my friends recently did a fundraiser for them. 
on Twitch. <coughs> and uh, she kind of expired, uh, kind of inspired me, not expired me, kind of inspired me to choose uh, the Trevor Project as a charity fund. Because I think they do good work. I think it would be very cool, very cool to give them some support. So if you have some free time at all uh, during our 24-hour stream, would love to see people come by. Would love to see some love for a good cause. Um, I kind of wish I could like disable like bits and subs for that stream. I don't think I can. But I'd like most of the donations that day not to go to me, but to go to you know the Trevor Project. But we will have a very explicit link set up that everyone can go to. What we got going on in here? Who's the, who's at the top of a party? Macaroni. Macaroni has the EXP share. Why am I putting him at the top? Maybe I should put Eggnog at the top. I think I'm going to put Eggnog at the top. Ooh, we got uh, stairs. We got stairs. We got a hole. Oh, shit. It appears I've landed on a wall. <laughs> oh shit. It appears I've landed on a wall. Hmm, <coughs> bit of a haunter here. Good thing we got bite still, and good thing I didn't replace bite. Oh, it's almost 5 o'clock. It's a pretty good time to uh, take my allergy meds, as I love to do on stream. It's a great opportunity for me to remind everyone, if you've got medication to take, if you've got water to drink, keep your kidneys working, keep your body running, keep your brain and mind functioning. Take your medicine. I'm about to take my allergy medicine, so I'm not blowing my nose every five minutes. Don't forget to take your medicine, my fellow gamers. I've been getting some bad swallows recently. I hate it when I can feel the medicine in my throat. I just wanted to go right down. Right down! Alright, there's our daily medicine break here at twitch.tv slash aonfo. Hope you enjoy. Can I go up into the right? No. Well, I can jump over those holes. Maybe I ought to try that. Maybe I ought to try that. Mm -mm. My controller button stuck. Did not trigger the second one. The second jump, that is. Again, I'm not using the best controller, but normally it's the D-pad that's fucking with me, not the buttons. There's another hole here. I got a bit messy with the homework, so yeah, I guess I'm just passing by today. Yo, no worries, dude. Holy shit, we got a raid. Whoa. Rat. Rat. Rat, 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 rat. Yo, rat. Thank you so much for the raid, dude. What were you, uh, what were you playing today? Let me give you a shout out, everybody. Check out our buddy Rat. Came in with this dope raid. Welcome on in, raiders. I hope y'all are having a great day. I hope everything is going fantastic. I got you that that shout out. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate the raid so much. Uh, what were you playing, dude? How was your stream? Nightbot, be quiet. I, I'm talking with my friends. <laughs> we're uh, we're playing some Pokemon Prism today. We're making good progress. We've actually got a uh, we've got developer in chat, guys. We got Pokemon Prism developer in chat, which is maybe the most exciting thing that's ever happened in my Twitch career. <laughs> maybe the most exciting thing. Well, mm, there are a lot. There have been a lot of exciting things that have happened on Twitch. But this is pretty fucking exciting. I was playing Omari today. Wonderful new... Ooh, psychological horror RPG. I to, hold on, let me write that down. I haven't heard of it. But psychological horror RPG sounds interesting. I kind of like psychological horror. I prefer it over, you know, your straight up. <laughs> Wretched Ren shits my pants and dies. Yo, welcome to the stream, Ren. How you doing? Do you prefer I call you uh, by uh, the name I know you by, IRL? Or do you prefer Ren on stream? Let me write down Oromi. Or Romy. That's pretty cool. Yo, thank you so much for the raid, dude. I appreciate it, Raph. It's super good. I was watching Raph play it. Oh, nice. I will have to check it out then if it's uh, recommended by multiple people. Can we jump over this? 
another hole. We're just jumping into holes today. Caden is fine. Yeah, welcome to the stream, Caden. Hope you're having a great day. We're playing some Pokemon Prism today. We are having a dope time. Let me climb up these stairs. Uh, if you haven't seen it yet, this is a ROM hack for Pokemon Crystal. There are 20 gym badges, two new uh, Pokemon types, uh, I think four regions overall, two new regions. There's mining, there's crafting, it's basically Minecraft. <laughs> no, it's not, it's not basically Minecraft. But there are mining and crafting and smelting and jeweling elements. I got pizza and I found out I have a job interview next week, so tonight slaps. Yo, that's dope! That's awesome. Uh, where are you? Uh, where are you interviewing? If you feel like sharing, of course, in this public forum, we respect privacy here. No need to share anything you don't want to. No problem. Glad to be here, dude. We're glad to have you. I uh, I saw you on earlier. I lurked a little bit, and then I had to run and catch my own stream. But I did see you on. I wasn't able to catch too much of the gameplay though. I was mostly just lurking. Everyone's on at the same time, you know. You know how it is. It's at a pet supply store. We stand small businesses. Yo, nice. Yeah, I remember you quit uh you quit the one pet supply job. And now it's gamer time. Uh, 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 but what? <laughs> Buttsbot? Um Butts do you know do you know Buttsbot? Are you friends with Buttsbot? Yeah, quit PetSmart. Fuck that noise. Do the small business thing. Do, uh do you know Buttsbot? Are you friends with Buttsbot? Buttsbot is uh <laughs> Buttspot is a, a bot that takes random messages that people say in chat and replaces words or syllables in the messages with a predetermined phrase. Um, Ludacris came in and changed that phrase to bloody queef. Uh, so that's what Buttspot's saying right now. Uh, for how many, how many channel points is it to change Buttspot's word. You can change Buttspot's word to anything you want as long as it's not something like uh, blatantly offensive, like transphobic, racist, ableist, homophobic, for 250 channel points. Whatever you want. It's all gonna come up as one word, is the one thing. It can only do one word. Wig. So whenever anybody gets tired of hearing about bloody queef from Buttspot, we can, we can make that change. We can make the change in our lives. This room smells very toxic. It's too hard to breathe up here. Whoa, smelly room. <laughs> I've had a couple of those. But, uh, um, wigs, bloody queefs, or toxic rooms? I, wait, wait, I don't wanna, do I wanna know? Do I want to guess? Do I want to know? Do I... Do I want to know? Do I want... Is this... Is this something I need to know? <laughs> Key smash. Oh, Jack Nicholson. Thank you, captions. Thank you. That's exactly what I said. I think I can guess. How are the... Ha you know what? We're just gonna move. We're gonna fight this Rhyhorn. Eggnog is gonna beat the shit out of this Rhyhorn. Absolutely surfing on the haters right now. Absolutely smurfing on the haters right now. We got a level up. Would you oh, we got another level up. Would you look at that? Would you look at that? Uh, yeah, so chat names all of our Pokemon. That's how we got Eggnog. Back with coffee and a little bit more happiness. I'm glad you found some happiness in coffee, dude. Welcome back, Sono. So here are our Pokemon. Let me run through our Pokemon for you, Caden. I think this will be fun. We got Eggnog, our Feraligator. We've got Carl, our Drifblim. This was traded to us from an NPC. So he was just named Carl. We didn't name Carl. But I think Carl is a great name. We have Luxray, who chat named Shinigami because chat's edgy. Coffee definitely helps with happiness. Yeah, I've felt that sometimes. Definitely. We have a Gengar that we named Funk. We also have a Gengar emote. Hold on. I've got I've got a Gengar emote that I made. Because I knew we were going to get a Gengar in this game. So I made an emote. Coffee just makes me shit myself. Yeah, coffee makes me bloody queef. <laughs> um, yeah, coffee makes me take a big old poopy. I feel that. But it also gives me a lot of energy. 
We got Buffalo Bill, our Typhlosion. And we got Macaroni, our Tyranitar. Tyranitar is actually the evolution of our starter. Your, uh, your starter is a Larvitar in this game. Wait, hole up. What am I holding up for? Oh, what did I just try to use? I was trying to press the B button. Go up the stairs. I think I already went all up, all up the stairs. I drink so much coffee, it barely gives me energy, and I get constipated if I don't drink any. Kind of fucked my body up a little bit, maybe. Maybe. Maybe too much coffee. It happens. We could have died. This arrow smells poisonous. Better not touch it. That's violent. We could have died. Have you ever died in a fucking Pokemon game before? Well, check out this one. You can fucking die. I was gonna call off, but I definitely have to go now. I just... Well, I was going to call off, but I def have to now. I just got sick. Oh, fuck, dude. Is this Sen's Fortress? <laughs> I made Larvitar the starter because it's one of my favorite lines. Because it's one of my favorite lines. And oh, evolutionary lines. I got you. And in gold, silver, crystal, you can't get one until the very end of the game. Dude, you would made a great choice. I love Larvitar. And it's true. You can't get them until late in the game. And it's kind of a shame. I always wanted to level a Larvitar as I was going through the game. I didn't want to pick up a Larvitar at the end and then get like a couple levels and push it up to a uh, Pupitar and Tyranitar. Yeah, Trevs, I hope you feel better, dude. That's fucking... Is it stomach stuff still? Is it, is it GI? Yo, uh, emetophobia trigger warning for uh, for my friends in the chat right now. Don't don't look. Uh, big big emeto trigger warning. Bro, I was literally getting ready and then I got sick. Damn. Yeah, well you definitely gotta definitely gotta call out now. Yeah, no worries. I got you, Caden. I got you. I uh, I think maybe if you refresh, the messages will uh will pop away. Maybe I don't know. Perhaps that's that. That's a big maybe. The messages might not pop away when you refresh. It's different on different channels. Yeah, dude. I I got I got that GI shit. I fucking hate that stuff. Oh, it shows on my stream. Oh, someone was someone was talking about uh just like a meadow stuff, Caden. I figured you wouldn't want to hear it. Yo, no problem. No problem at all, bud. I I, I pretend I do not see it. <laughs> nice. Yeah, dude, I, I hope you feel better. Um, definitely call out of work. Definitely. Definitely call out of work. I hope they... F oh, I see an item right there and I fall down the hole! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Whoa! hole I fell down another hole wait hold on hold on let me let me pull out quote one let me pull out quote number one y'all are gonna love quote number one get hold show hole yeah <coughs> while go bot pit it not go eggnog how about Dragon Pulse? Is Dragon Pulse a big sexy move? Oh, look at that. I love the moves where the screen turns black. Whole stream. Whole stream. I learned we've been pronouncing Emeto wrong this whole time. It's Emito? Well, that just sounds... That just sounds ridiculous. Emito? Nice to Emito you. Shut up. It's, no, that, that's silly. I'm going to keep pronouncing it wrong. <laughs> it, it does. I hate it. Yeah, no, you're valid. That sounds... That's such a weird pronunciation. <laughs> Play us a tune. Standard. Feel free to delay this to the next convenient moment. It's always a convenient moment, because I always want to play guitar. Let's do a little bit of a, a tune for Sono. Let me mute the game. Let me pull up the main scene. Oh, God. My face. In the standard tuning, I gotta reach that standard tuning guitar. What are we gonna play today? 
Um, maybe I should play something I've composed before. Perhaps. What have I composed? What have I written? Play, uh, play, uh, Mario. I fucked it up. Play, um, what's a good, what's a good song? It's a good song I've written. Oh, you know what? I don't even have to play something I've written. I can try to play something else. How to play this. Gerudo Valley from uh, from Zelda, Ocarina of Time. No, I can't hear on the phone. Oh no, you missed such a good performance, dude. Hope y'all enjoyed that. That's a that's a classic little video game tune. I hope you enjoyed. It's not quite Mario, but it's uh it's in the same vein. Zelda, I guess. Quick question: What's that fucking slurp? Oh, is it this? Is it, is it this? Yeah, it's just my shitty headset. I gotta get a new one. I've got to get a new one at some point. That was good, mate. Yo, thank you, Wrath. I appreciate it. Let me, uh, let me turn the game audio back up so I can hear it and you guys... It sounds wet. I sound wet. We like to keep the channel nice and moist here. In fact, here, everybody, everybody, get a little bit of, get a little bit of water. Take a little slurp. <laughs> moist. For a while, Buttsbot's word was moist. And you know there are those people who hate the word moist? Everyone was hating that. It doesn't bother me personally. Moist cords. Yeah, I got some moist corduroys. That's a lie. I don't even own a pair of corduroys. It's an absolute lie. I'm lying to you guys. You y'all are letting me absolutely take you for a ride. Shart. <laughs> you wouldn't believe how popular of a word that is. Speaking of things that are moist. <laughs> Shart. <laughs> If I had a if I had a Simpsons OC, it would be Shart Simpson. Nah, it'd probably be like some stupid shit like Bart Flintstone. It is. That's my Final Fantasy's character name. Moist Shart. Sounds about right. Is the Sim is the Flintstones theme DMCAable? Can we just listen to the fucking Flintstones theme on stream? Shart Flintstone. <laughs> nice. So I called my manager and they didn't pick up for almost 10 minutes. Classic. Classic manager. Lots of gold bats here. Lots, lots of gold bats we got, uh, got to fight our way through. They're busy managing things. They're just a band. We were just a band. We are the Beatles. It's just a band. Ringo plays the drums. Can I, can I redeem points for you to shit your pants on stream? Unfortunately, no. Why do I sound... Why do you sound like them? We're just a band. We're just the Beatles. Ringo plays the drums. It's because they sound like basic little British Liverpool boys. 
And that's a pretty easy accent to accomplish. Unfortunately. <laughs> well, I guess it depends on your perspective, Sono. I do have to fart soon, I think. You, you know when you feel like a fart welling up inside you? I feel like there's a pretty pretty solid fart coming. Yo! Jerrica, welcome to the stream. Oh, you beat me to the latex. You always beat me to the latex. I try to race every time, and she always gets it first. <laughs> it's ridiculous. I guess I'm too vanilla for this shit. Pun intended. Guro! Is frog time for your frog costume? Yeah, it's... Hold on, it's right... I don't want to point my camera at it, but it's right over there. If you put frog time on, I will put on the frog onesie for the rest of the stream. I'll have to take a little break to put it on. Guro! Guro! My buddy, welcome to the stream. Oh my god, poison arrow? Another poison arrow. We could have died right here. We could have died, guys. We could have fucking ate it. Wait, we're already in the bottom, and we're falling down again? Okay, interesting. Oh, all the lights are off now. When did the lights turn off in this game? <laughs> Oops, dies in Pokemon. Fucking dies in Pokemon. Yeah. How's everybody doing? Jerichondra, how are you doing today? Guro, how are you doing today? How are you guys doing? Welcome into the stream. Is this a horror game or some shit? No, 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 it's not a horror game. Working, working, working and lurking, working, lurking, working. I did not say kitten. I did not say kitten captions. We're shart working. Ha 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 ha. It's not, no, it's not a horror game. Might play COD today, lol, but I don't know. Sounds like we should play some, uh, some Battlefront 2 once I get that shit downloaded. Uh, for real though, I th if, uh, if anyone in TTO is going to play some Battlefront 2 later, I might be on. Oh, you know what? At 10 p.m. tonight, I gotta go... This is going to sound so stupid. This is going to sound so stupid to everyone who doesn't play Final Fantasy XIV. I got to play, uh, I got to be on Final Fantasy XIV because my friend is getting Final Fantasy XIV married at 10 p.m. And I can't miss it. Imagine playing Shart. I don't have to imagine. <laughs> Puff is going to play this weekend. Dope. Puff is cool. Puff is cool as fuck. Yo, Pog! Pog! Poggers! I'm gonna be playing while I'm not working? Hell yeah. Who do we need to level up? Funk. Bring in the noise, bring in the funk. <laughs> Kermit the Pog. Pog Frog onesie. Okay. Is there a way for me to continue in this area? Is there? I'm getting lost. Frog champ. Hold on. Caden, you haven't seen frog flex. You haven't seen fro- Hold on, let me frog flex for you. Check that shit out. I woke up now. You look fun today too. Yo, thank you. Congratulations on waking up. I'm feeling fun today. I'm feeling like we got some fun energy. Thank you for tuning in, Guru. I'm glad you came to hung hang out. Your character looks like a uh, sow from Mob Psycho. Yo, um, Ono came in here earlier and said fucking something like Ginger Vegeta, and it got me rolling. Shit was funny. You want to use banned chemical weapons against Pokemon? The Geneva Convention's banned mustard gas, but you can use it as a, as a move in this game. To think, when I get my new CPU, my computer's going to work a hundred times better. Dude, I gotta upgrade my CPU. Gingita. Yo, shit, Trevs, is it your birthday? Is it your birthday, Trevs? How did I not know? Yo, Trevs. Happy birthday, man. Can we get a can we get a happy birthday in chat? Can we get a bunch of happy birthdays for Trevs? Do, do we all want to sing the birthday song? Hold on. Let's sing the birthday song. Everybody, you know how it goes. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. You, happy birthday, dear, it's Trev's three, happy birthday to you. <laughs> he just left the chat. <laughs> happy birthday to you. It'd be 
nice if I had that compressor working, huh, guys? So no, I still gotta, I still gotta fucking do that audio ducking thing you sent me. I keep getting fucking. Dis oh, Dawn fan, Dawn fan. Yo, check out my uh, my uh, OnlyFans Dawn fans. So, yeah, so no, I still gotta check out that audio ducking. I keep seeing it on Cubone's stream, and I keep seeing it in your stream, and I'm like, holy shit. This audio ducking is so sexy. But I'm just so busy, I never get the chance to. I think I want to do it before the 24 hour, but... There's no, um... There's no assurance I can do that. I still have to get a lot of sources set up for tomorrow's stream, is the thing. My game audio is down. Thank you for the reminder. Sometimes I forget. Let me pop that shit back up. Thank you so much, Caden. Appreciate it. Cubone, you gonna yeah, Cubone, you gonna play Battlefront two with us? Aw, oh, no, dude, we still gotta play Left for Dead. I'm gonna play some Left for Dead on stream tomorrow with Ludicrous. If you wanna, if you wanna come fuck with us on that. How was the back for Blood Alpha, by the way? How how was the back for Blood Alpha, or Beta, or whatever the fuck they're on? I have Left for Dead too. Yeah, that's the one we're gonna be playing, Trevs. If you want to come by the stream tomorrow, we can. I don't know which time we're gonna do it. I don't know when we're gonna. We, we might hit it a couple times. It's hard to say. We've got no plan for the stream except for play a shit ton of games with some people, and you know, collect money. Back for Blood Alpha was good. Wonder how they're going to adjust because it was tough. Yeah, they might make it a bit easier, but I remember Left 4 Dead being like a pretty tough game, anyways. So they might just leave it tough. Of course, I didn't play it, so I can't. I can't compare the two. I was not lucky enough to get an alpha code. Cry. Sad. Big big cry. What time? I have therapy at 5 to 6 p.m. and I have a B-day dinner around 7 to 8. So we're going to be on stream all day. Let me plug the stream again. For 24 hours, starting tomorrow at 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and going t until 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Saturday. Uh, Ludacris and I are going to be streaming in order to get uh, donations for the Trevor Project, which is an organization which provides crisis support to LGBTQIAP plus individuals. It's going to be a really cool stream. We've been planning it for a while. So um, we're going to be here for 24 hours. So, you know, nobody's going to stick around the whole time. But really, whenever you're free, if you got a free moment to come by, drop some love for a good cause. That would be super epic. Um, but really, like, no specific time, Trevs. It's just gonna be all day. <laughs> Yo, I have Left 4 Dead 2, apparently. Honestly, didn't know. If you guys are ever down a player, when you're playing that, I'd be down. Hell yeah. Oh, damn, that's awesome. I'll come hang when I get home from grocery shopping. Yo, I appreciate it so much, bud. I appreciate it so much. Where are we fucking going in this game? I'm lost. I'm lost. Mwah! I'm absolutely lost. Uh, yeah, that's dope as fuck, guys. I am so excited to play some Left 4 Dead. I, Cubone and I, and a couple others, and I think Ono, and maybe Athy, a couple of us were talking about playing Left 4 Dead, like, weeks ago, maybe even a month ago, and I downloaded it, and I've been waiting for the moment to re-experience some Left 4 Dead for so long now. I need it. I require it. It must fuel me. Fuel me forward. I'm gonna have to stop by for that. Yo, I appreciate it, Rath. It'll be great to see everybody. It'll be super dope. Yeah, we we've been planning this 24 hour for a while. I think it was one of the one of the first things we actually talked about doing when I returned to the streaming scene, when I when I hit affiliate and stuff, when I came back and started streaming for real for real. Um that was one of the first things I had talked about with Ludacris. We're gonna get a we're gonna do a 24 hour for charity. It's gonna happen. And finally, here we are, a couple months later. The Toxic Room. Okay. We might be fucked. We might... We might not have progression here. There was an item somewhere, right? Did I miss that item? Did I not get that? Last time I played uh, was on the first release on the 360. I played it on 360 once, but then I bought it on Steam, and I've played it there ever since. Is gas good against poison? I don't remember. 
Well, let me just download it, set up the source and everything, because I don't stream, because <laughs> I don't not stream anymore, and I'm good to go. Hell yeah! You let me know because I also have to download it, but it will take five minutes. Dope. Oof, envy that downlink speed. Gas type. <laughs> yeah, they added two new uh, types to this game. They added gas, and they added uh, sound. Yeah, they got new types. It's really cool. Really cool stuff. I'm not very good at them yet. Haven't quite figured them out. But yeah, there's a, there's a move called mustard gas in this game. I always think that's funny, because it was banned by the Geneva Conventions. Yet enemies will use it on each other. It's Pokemon, but with illegal weaponry. I have an M NVMe SSD, and I also have Gig Up, Gig Down. Nice. I would be a gas. <laughs> I would be a gas sound type because I just fart and scream. Yeah, I I, I hear that. I hear that, dude. Hey, we got an item. We got Sandstorm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's me. That's my Caden impression. It's me after chili. Shart. F fucking spot on. We were just a band. We're in the Beatles. Ringo plays the drums. Which Beatle am I? Which Beatle sounds like this? Why would I use Dark Pulse on a Steel type? The fuck is wrong with me? Oh. Never mind. That's actually fine fine move to use. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Wah 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 wah. Wah 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 ba ba ba. Wah wah. Wah wah ba ba. Um. Wah wah wee wah. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna repel. I just need, I need to spend some time exploring this area. And every time I get into... Oh, I saw an item. I have to head out, but I hope you have a great stream. Have a good one, everyone. Yo, thank you so much for coming by, Wrath. Thank you so much for the raid. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Before you run away, let me drop you a shout-out. Yo! Sarah Janey 17 Yo! I heard you did your first stream today. I was asleep. I came in right when you raided. Thank you so much for the follow, follow Sarah. If you're here... Uh, I don't mean to call you out of lurk, but let me drop you a guitar improv because what we do for our new followers here, we play a little bit of a little bit of a guitar improv for everybody who comes in and joins the stream with a follow. So I hope you enjoy. Oh, let me grab my guitar. Welcome to the stream and welcome to uh, streaming on Twitch in general. Improv me tender. What are we gonna play? <laughs> Hope you enjoyed. Welcome to the uh, the follower pack, Sarah. Oh, let me put that shit all right the fuck over there. Oh shit! I gotta unplug my phone. It's at a hundred percent. Look at that. Look at that. All right. Let me get the the game. Thought that was Barracuda by Heart for a sec. I don't know if I know that song. Oh no! Is that the song that goes? <laughs> I was about to say something so stupid. I was about to say, is that the song that goes Barracuda? I don't actually know that song. Barracuda. I don't know. Do I know it? I don't know. I don't. I might. Hey, does my stream look like fucking shit right now? Because my bitrate's dying. Oh, I haven't seen Charlie's Angels. I haven't seen that. Not really? Okay, cool. 
Yes, shit everywhere. Yeah, we're shitting everywhere. Today must be a bad internet day, I guess. Sometimes it happens. Sometimes we're fine for the entire stream, and then sometimes... <sighs> we be shitting, though. Sometimes... Doesn't want to work for us. I'm gonna jump right over this. Get the item. We got a pearl. Well, we got a pearl. Whoa, Steven Universe Kinnies be wildin'. We already went that way. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> right, this is the toxic room. Keep walking up there. Is there like an HM I can use to avoid the toxicity? There are still more paths I can explore. We're not we're not like at a dead end here. Repels effect. Like System of a Down? That's not the first time we mentioned System of a Down today. <laughs> the toxicity of our city. Of our city. Yo! What do you own the world? What do you own? Disorder! Disorder! Oh, there's the item I wanted. Gas mask! Imagine if we had left. Imagine if we had left before we got that. Wig. Absolute... Ripped off my head. Ripped off my fucking wig. I'm bald right now. I'm balding. I've lost my hair. We were just a band with the Beatles. We wrote that song Hard Day's Night. We stole all of our musical ideas from uh from other bands <laughs> with the Beatles. Look, we can walk right by here. Hard Gaze Night. <laughs> That's going to be uh, tomorrow during the Trevor Project stream. I knew there was going to be a hole here. I fucking knew there was going to be a hole there. I knew there was going to be a hole there. Ah, <sighs> so many holes. So little time. That's just how life is, though. You know? So many holes, so little time. That's just... That's just how living is. Well, then why the fuck did you go there? It's because I was trying to press the button to jump over it. But I, I don't have it quite figured out, like, pressing the button to jump over holes that don't yet appear on the map. If that makes sense. Like, I'm tr pressing the button here. I'm still pressing the button, hoping we're not going to fall down a hole. Slugma! This would be perfect for naming one of the Pokemon that we have to name. Sugma. Because someone wanted to name a Pokemon Sugma. You fucking bastards. We've just got to not kill it. We've just got to not kill it. Oh, he looks wonky. Red to come -o. Red to come Slugma is a big red cum. I don't remember if it was in chat or if it was me who asked for it, but one or the other. All I, I don't remember all of them, but I know that someone at some point during our last Pokemon stream asked for Sugma. I'm surprised you haven't done a Bart Simpson burp. You're right. I, I've kind of not been doing those on stream recently. I used to do those all the time. Sometimes I'll burp and then I'll just say Flintstone or Simpson without actually saying the Bart part in the Bart. I don't know what's wrong with me. Uh, hit him with a rock smash. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, the weakest move killed it. Oh fuck, how are we gonna catch one of those? It makes Jody laugh really hard? I'm glad. I'm glad I'm a, I'm a funny haha. -ha. The one button, the one, the one, the one that I wasn't trying to jump over hole hole guess what guys we found more hole does the modding system of left for dead determine who you play with i have no clue if you have mods that the rest of us don't have it might not work perfectly but i think we can just make our own parties and uh do it like that if I Dark Pulse this Torkoal, will it survive it? Can I catch it? Yes! Okay, we're gonna catch this... Hmm. 
Okay. Bro, he's hitting a fat vape. <laughs> oh, yeah. Because I have a custom loading screen. I think that should be fine. I think a custom loading screen should be fine. It's like if you were doing uh, custom campaigns, it might affect us. Let's try him in a great ball. Okay, guys, we got two. I, I got two options for what we could call this. I'm going to type them both in chat. The first one is Anita Sug. The second one. <sighs> the second one is Vaginosaur. <sighs> great ball. Yo, <laughs> yeah, great balls, dude. <laughs> great balls. Yeah, I don't think the great balls are going to work. I think I'm going to have to do the ultra balls. Unless it actively locks you out of multiplayer, it should be fine. Yeah, custom cane, custom campaign does affect it. Yeah, custom cocaine. Vaginosaur. All right, we're going to name it Vaginosaur. We're going to name this fucker Vaginosaur. I, I bet DMAC was the one who suggested this. I don't mean to take credit from anyone. I don't mean to take credit from anyone if someone other than DMAX suggested this one, but this specific name, I, you know, I just got a feeling, I got a feeling welling up deep in my soul that says uh, DMAC was the one who suggested this. Perfect. Hold up. Please name one Stinky. Okay, hold on. Let me write it down. Let me write it down. Stinky. Stinky. I need to cross off a vaginosaur. So now on our list, we've got Stinky, Sugma, Anita Sug, and Aorn. Someone came into the stream during my secret Minecraft stream, and they were like, Name one Aorn. Not Aeon, not Aaron. Name it Aorn. <laughs> uh oh. Stinky poop, la 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 la, funny, funny poopies, la. It was probably DMAC, because from how perfectly it fits, I know it was someone who tweets. Uh, yeah, yeah. Jump. Oh no, I've got to jump over it, but there's a fucking wheezing here. Wheezing. I cannot escape this. Oh yeah, Jody's got it down. Jody's got that shit down. Is gas good against gas? I literally forgot. I've literally forgotten, you see. Let's try not shade. We were just a band. We're just a band. We're just the Beatles. Ringo's not even the best drummer in the band. Okay, fuck it. Try mustard gas. The Beatles. <laughs> Datcom. Yeah, that I I don't have a Discord either, but let me let me link Datcom for us. Datcom is kind of like our communal Discord. No one person is the sole owner of the Discord, if that makes sense. Um We all it's kind of like our big communal Discord. It's kinda of like TTO. It's kinda of like TTO. Um it's a big community Discord, not just like one person. It's for everyone to be friends together. It is the Discord that I have chosen to plug the most because I I don't want my own separate Discord. Like maybe maybe someday like far in the future if we ever like grow to a ridiculous extent, yes, I will consider making a Discord. But right now, I think me making a Discord would kind of just plug up everybody's notifications and I there are already like millions of discords that everybody's in I don't I don't want to plug up everybody's notifications you feel me so I use datcom that's that's the discord that I like to uh, identify with generally bop di bop jump over that sh there was another one yeah because I would join and just post pictures of noodle you can join Datcom and maybe post pictures of Noodle. Do we have a Do we have a pets channel in Datcom? If not, if we don't have a pets channel, I need to make a, a, a fucking a pets channel. I need to do it. If we don't have a pets channel, I will make one. Yeah, shart. Because I would just join and post sharchers of <laughs> sharchers. Yeah, sometimes it just picks syllables instead of uh, actual whole words. 
Sharchers, a picture of a shark. Hey, we got another chance at Sugma. Sugma balls. Wish you had a, a v voice call channel on your spot. In um in the Datcom. I could make a voice channel in Datcom, but there are a lot of other voice can channels in Datcom. Yeah, Sono, I'm pretty sure, does have one. Yeah, Sono says, I do. I believe Sono does. We don't want to use laughing gas, because that's strong. Do we want to use cut? I feel like cut's going to kill it. What isn't going to kill it? What isn't going to kill this guy? Cut is maybe the weakest move I have. Oh, what if I use a fire move against him? Yeah, but Buffalo Bill is also like 20 levels stronger. Glass type. I don't have any glass type. I had a, I had a bay leaf named Kalachi, but we we traded our bay leaf out for I don't know probably Gengar. It's push to talk. Beef. Beef. All right, Flame Wheel. I'm begging you. Please don't kill. Please don't kill Sugma. Please. Please. Oh. Pog. I need to stop deep throating this microphone. Good practice, though. What can I say? <laughs> my cat's asleep on my chest, and I started laughing at beef. You know what I really want to try doing? I want to try pulling up Reaper in the background of a stream sometime, and just modulating my voice and feeding the voice through that instead of through the microphone, so it comes through the desktop audio. And then I'll, I can like talk like with delay or like all these weird effects. I think that'd be super fun. Beef, 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 beef. Put reverb on some fart noises I make. That would be amazing. That would be so fun. I gotta get that set up at some point. Toss the ultra ball. Toss the ultra ball. What do you say, folks? What do you say, Fox? Please, please. Farts. Farts with reverb are the funniest fucking thing. They're so fucking funny. I don't know what it is. I just, I don't know. It's just fucking funny. Yo, I just had an idea. Hit me with that idea, Sona. Hit me with that idea. Enlighten me, my friend. Alright, this one's gonna be Sugma. Cross this name off our list. I think I could add that street that feature to that stream deck. Yeah, I was I was gonna say that would be like a great feature to incorporate. Something, some voice modulation. Whether you gotta route it through a uh, Reaper or Audacity or something like that, that could be a great feature. All right, guys, do we think there's two holes that are gonna block us here? Do we think there's two holes? Do we have to run all the way around? I'm gonna try it. I'm pressing the jump button. Okay. Do we want to step here? Look at that. But there's also something to the north on the wall that I want to check out. So, no, that would be fucking awesome if you could add that to that stream deck. You're making me want to get a Raspberry Pi so I can run that stream deck. I think I might have to. I might have to. It might be something I do after... I have a, another monitor sitting behind me that I have to set up and put on the, the wall in front of me. After I get that set up, I think that might be a really good quality of life improvement for the stream if I got a Raspberry Pi and set up that stream deck on it. Could be really cool. Laughing gas. Laughing gas. Laughing gas. Don't use Psybeam on me, you fucking clown. You absolute fucking muppet. Oh, I need some water. I can just make a feature that toggles a specific audio source filter, and then just set up a VST in OBS. Oh, nice. Nice. That'd be pretty cool. That'd be pretty cool. Hear me out. What if... What if we took the feed from the microphone, passed it through a MIDI converter, and applied synths to that MIDI. 
That would sound like garbage, huh? <laughs> but wouldn't it be fun? <laughs> the switch is on and labeled Tell him. Tell him what? Tell him? I don't even know him. It'd be fun garbage, absolutely. Turn the switch off. Well, we're not telling him anymore. A green guy. Oh shit, there's a there's a chest there? Is that a chest? Green guy. Green guy. I think green guy has a macaroni. What the fuck is that? Oh, that's a that's the pallet ranger. That's a pa oh yeah, the chest. It's a mimic. It's a mimic, you say? But it's locked. Looks like four items can fit in front. Could this be the way to unlock this thing? Ho ho ho! Four items, huh? Four items need to fit in front of this fucker? What kind of items? That's the only information I can get. Alright, we want to fight this, um... My four balls! Four pinguses! Chat! Ch chat! <laughs> <coughs> My god, you guys, you're probably right. I should probably just fleshlight the fuck out of this chest, huh? Do you guys like my cape? Do you guys like my, my cape? I have a cape. Could you just stop already? <laughs> We're looking for the shards of the turtle guardian. We'll be wealthy if we want <laughs> the shards of a turtle guardian. Okay, so what do I have to find for shards of a turtle guardian? They're looking for the shards! The shards! They're gonna find the shards! Palette Green sent out Zatu. Turtle sharts? That's that's fucking disgusting. What are they shart in the shell? I didn't oh, I didn't want to use fly. I got too excited. Too excited. I had better moves to use, not fly. Oh wow, fly did like a good good amount of damage though, not gonna lie. My cat left. It's cause I was making you laugh too much. I'm sorry. It's my fault. Good goodbye, cat. You know what cat we haven't seen in a while? My cat has not come up to be a guest star on the stream in a couple weeks. She used to walk up in the middle of stream. She would scratch on my door asking to get in. And uh, she would pop up on stream. And she just hasn't been here in a little while. She's sleeping somewhere else. She like rotates through different sleeping spots throughout, um, throughout the months, throughout the weeks. And so I think she's just at a, at a different sleeping spot right now. I need to see her. Me too. Eventually, I'm sure, like, at some point, she will come up during stream. She used to do it all the time. It's been a while since she's done it. But I'm sure when she rotates sleeping spots again, she'll come up during stream and she'll want to hang out. <laughs> Simpson. <laughs> Simpson. Yeah, boy! Ludicolo, Ludicolo. That is a <laughs> look at look at his eyes. Oh, that's Ludicolo, all right. That is Ludicolo. He's wearing eyeliner. Ludicolo's wearing eyeliner. Um, got a dip for a bit. I might be back in a little later. Yo, thank you so much. Have fun. That's horrifying. Thank you so much for coming by. Uh, take care of whatever you gotta take care of. I appreciate seeing you in chat. Hope you can make it back if we're uh, if we're still on. I'm not sure how much longer I'm gonna be on. I gotta get some food. Uh, probably another hour. Maybe another hour. I wanna get through whatever chunk of the game I'm attempting right now. Um, yeah, yeah. Let's throw eggnog out for a sec. Just getting getting them the XP. Yeah, see, I tricked this guy. I tricked him by putting out a water type because he would have been he would have been dumb to use a grass type move. Putting Carl. Carl can finish the job. Razor Leaf. It's not very effective. You fucking idiot. You loser. Give me a f- Aw, oh, come on, I missed. Fuck. Fuck. Shit. Give me another fly. Give me another one. 
There we go, I hit that one. I took more damage than I should have. Not very epic, but that's okay. That's okay. Look at that XP. Look at that level up. Look at that, look at that big boy. Look at that, look at that big boy. Look at the big boy. Leafeon, eh? Leafeon. Yo, leave Carl in for a sec. <laughs> that sure is Leafeon. Uh, leave Carl in. Uh, Funk's got the XP share, right? Uh, I don't want to throw Eggnog in, because he'll get whacked. He'll get doinked. Let's throw Buffalo Bill in and just torch him. Just wanted to get Carl that XP from being in the fight for a hot sack. <laughs> Excuse me. The tea must be wearing off. Alright, I gotta hide my camera for a sec and blow my nose. Got them, got them allergies. Just don't want to look ugly on stream with a fucking uh, toilet paper, not toilet paper, tissue in my nose. Sat camera back on. Now you can see my face again. You're a, you're allowed to gaze upon my face now. Tyranitar. Do we want to do the battle of the Tyranitars? Um. Mm, I kind of. Oh, that could be a mistake. That Tyranitar Tyranitar could have pursuit. And if it has pursuit. It's probably going to use it as I switch out Funk immediately. And it's going to kill Funk, and then Funk's not going to... Oh, the Sandstorm's going to kill Funk. Didn't even think about that. I was thinking too many steps ahead that I didn't think about the simple thing. Thought about the complex thing, didn't think about the simple thing. What an idiot. <laughs> Get a load of this fucking idiot. <laughs> what, what am I doing? What am, what am I doing? Um... So I really want to do the, the battle of the, the Tyranitars, but Eggnog needs the XP. It did have Pursuit. It did have Pursuit. Oh! oh. I was correct about the, the, the complex thing. God damn, that was two Pokemon down. Two Pokemon are not going to get XP now. Ah! Ah! Ah. Uh, uh. Oof. Man, you forget how much damage that sandstorm does over time. You really do. You don't appreciate it. You don't appreciate the times when you don't have a sandstorm raging that's battering your Pokemon. Oh! Fucking Gengar doesn't have the EXP share. Macaroni has the EXP share. But now Funk doesn't have any life. So... Do we have a revive? I doubt it. I doubt we've got a revive. <clears throat> nope. No revives. We found a white jewel. Hey, give me all those other jewels. Look, I need to get paid, you know? Everyone needs to make a living. Somehow. Somehow. Fuck. Damn, we're taking damage. We, we took some damage here. Should I pop out of here? Well, there's a door right here. What if we pop... Enemy time. Enemy time! One step away from the door! Power Bell is sound? No, sound wasn't good against rock. This guy's really got nothing. But he's he's like 20 levels higher, so bite should be okay. Uh, yeah, use Thunder Fang, dude. That, you're fucking smart as shit, man. Um... I really want to give the EXP share to Eggnog, but I really want to give it to Funk. 
Funk's fucking dead, so I guess I'll just leave it on macaroni and grind up more. <clears throat> okay. Hey, at least it's a Shuppet. We love Shuppet. Lamps, look away, because I'm probably going to kill this Shuppet in one hit. Sorry, bud. Sorry, my friend. <laughs> We're good. We're good. Ooh, level 49. We're about to break level 50. Base Tremor. Base Tremor. Hold on, let me look up this move real quick. Let me look up Base Tremor. Pokemon Prism Base Tremor. What does Base Tremor do? Base Tremor is a move in Pokemon Prism. It has a base power of 100 and 100% 100 accuracy. We love the 100% accuracy moves. We love them. 100 power? That's pretty fucking good, guys. That's pretty good. I think we're going to replace Power Ballad with that. Learned base, Tremor. Absolutely lovely. Absolutely poggers, isn't that right? Oh, I can't walk through this door. I cannot walk through this door. Okay. Well, fuck, what is this? There's a hole in the... Oh! There's a hole in the ceiling. Okay. Alright, hold on. Let me get out of here. Let me drop a repel. Let me get out, out of here. Um, trying to remember the layout. I think we go down one more floor. Yeah, it's done setting up OBS things now, dude. Nice. I'm excited. Everyone's gonna play some uh, some Left 4 Dead. Yeah, it used to be one of my favorite games when I grew up. Yeah, use another repel, I guess. Do we have to go down another floor? We might have to go down another floor. Is this it? Oh, shit. Now we're down another floor. Now we're down another floor. We go over here, go to the right, run out here. There we go. It's dark here. Oh, is it dark because it turned to night? Might have turned to night. Ah, it turned to night in the game, guys. That's why it suddenly got dark everywhere. I get it. I get it. You can still fly even though you're fainted. I appreciate that. Appreciate it huge, bud. Let's hit this Pokemon Center. We got we got some more to do. I gotta make a little more progress in this game. I gotta figure out where to go and I gotta do it. I gotta do it. <laughs> we hope to see you again. Repellent <laughs> effect wore off right at the door. Yeah, thanks, bud. Thank you. This fucking, this fucking item, it taunts me. It sits there and it taunts me. <laughs> someday, someday we'll get fucking strength. We'll move that item, we'll move that rock and get that item. Let's surf a little bit. I like how the sprite is red here. What are you blocking? Can I go in here? Can't let anybody in here without a proper knowledge of ID. You don't have yours? You're lucky I'm nice to miners, otherwise I'd arrest you right here on the- Fuck you, man. Fuck you, dude. Hey, fuck you, man. Grow the fuck up. Okay, do I want to head back in here? Do I want to go back in here? Is there more I could explore that I'm missing? Hold on. Let me look up the map. Let me look up, uh... Pokemon Prism Naljo Ruins Map. Let me just take a look. Take a little peek around, yeah? Palette yellow, palette green. I've beaten them both. White jewel. Brown jewel is after... I, wow, I haven't found any of these jewels. Oh, there's a red... Okay, so there's more... There's more that I could get in here. I should go back. I should go back in there. Okay. I should go back in here. I just gotta find everything. I just gotta do the exploration and find everything. Not there. Can you surf on this? It's an oasis. Wanna take a... Can I just take a... Ru oh my gosh! I could heal there the entire time! 
I was walking all the way back, or flying back to the Pokemon Center. I could could have just healed there the entire time, guys. I feel silly now. All right, so let me look up where exactly to go here. The white jewel is on the sixth floor. We got that. The brown jewel is on the fourth floor after hitting the switch labeled Murum on the second floor. Okay. Well, we have not hit the Murum switch. We hit a Tellum switch. We did not hit a Murum switch. So that's going to be one floor up from here. Let me pop another repel. I don't normally like using repels, but sometimes you just got to do some exploring and you will lose your focus if you don't use repels, I find. There's an arrow there. Oh, we hit a switch, maybe. And that switch prevented that arrow from coming? Anyways, here's a switch. The switch is on and labeled Murum. Turn it off. Yes, okay. So now Murum's off. So now we can get... We can get the brown jewel on floor 4 after hitting Murum. And on this floor, floor 2... Are we on floor 2? Yeah, we're on floor 2, I think. On floor two, we can get the red jewel, but we have to return to floor three and fall through the hole on the most northwest point of hole three. Holy shit. So many holes. So many holes. So little time, guys. What are we going to do? Oh, I see an item. Okay, hold on. We're on floor one, floor two, I think, right now. Let's try to get up to floor three. Let's try to get up to floor three here. And then we want to fall through the northmost hole. Right? Is that it? Yeah, just use another repel. We only got one more anyways. The northmost hole? The northmost hole. Should be a hole up here somewhere, maybe? 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 <laughs> maybe? Hold on. Let me, let, me, let me check this guy again real quick. Bum, ba, da, ba. Return to floor three and fall through the hole on the northwestern point of the floor. Okay. Let's go to the northwest here. Let's go up here. Any holes? There's a hole. There's the hole, guys. Good news, guys. We found the hole. That's the red jewel. That's two of the jewels. So we went down from three to two. Um... The blue jewel is going to be on the third floor, and the brown jewel, <laughs> poopy brown, the brown jewel is going to be on the fourth floor. Oh, we got to go down here. We'll find them all. We'll find them all, guys. I just need a little, a little bit of assistance. Repels effect wore off. I could use more repels, but I kind of want to fight stuff now. What are we on? We were just on floor two. This must be floor one. Let's go up. Get to floor three, guys. Go jump, jump, go over here, fight. Haunter. Got a bit of a haunter in the scene. Ghost hammer. I wonder if your boy Vendetta 7 has found this area. Your boyfriend at 7? <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, closed captioning. Whenever you're done, I'm in your Discord. Nice. Y'all playing some Left 4 Dead? If I got some time after I hop off, I might uh, I might come bother you guys for some Left 4 Dead. I gotta eat, though. Realistically, I probably won't have time, but I'd like to pretend in my head that I could play some Left 4 Dead. What was I doing in here? Oh, right. I wanted to switch the, the EXP share from Macaroni to Funk. Scroll all the way down for the EXP share. Isn't that right? Isn't that quite right? Oh shit, look at our fucking garbage bitrate. Look at our fucking garbage bitrate. I gotta end stream soon. I can't keep streaming with this. This is bad. Someone, someone in my house is using some fucking internet or something. Alright. You know what? I'm gonna call it here. Okay, I'm gonna call it after this fight. We're gonna do this fight. Unless the bitrate shoots back up.
we're gonna do this fight, and then if the bitrate's still struggling, we're gonna we're gonna raid out. We're gonna call it because that is that is an abysmally low number. That is disgusting. Someone is someone is sucking up all the data in my house right now. Someone's downloading some shit or something. <laughs> I have to be like, no, no, no. They should take down OnlyFans. What did OnlyFans do? And replace it with only Don fans. Donthly fans. That's exactly what we said when we saw our first Don fan in this game. Okay. I hate to do it right in the middle of this dungeon, but this bitrate is fucking abysmal, and I don't want anyone anyone seeing this garbage. So we're gonna get ready to raid out. Thank you everybody for coming by. I'm gonna I'm gonna start scoping out some raid targets here.